Village Expo, the 10 ball event here at uh, this, the Greater Greater Billiards Expo, I guess you can tell. It's at the, the Greater Expo at the Philadelphia Center. Yep. At the Oaks, Donnie Mills and Toasty Holman. We're here with Epps State Al. This is the corner man, Freddie Agnier. Freddy. And we're here with Steve Sutton. 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 Death. Yeah, Sutton Death. <laughs> Sutton Death. Oh, Thank you for that introduction <laughs> there, uh, Freddie. Yeah. Donnie Mills to break here. Donnie Mills from Florida, the west coast of Florida. Two ball in side pocket and Donnie Mills being the racker, you expect that two ball yeah. to go in side pocket every time. Interestingly enough, the other second the ball, the, uh, four, the ball four ball also yeah. went. So if he's wait, wait, both. did you say Donnie Mills being a racket, a two ball's gonna go in all the time? Yeah. <laughs> what I'm saying is that he is paying attention to how the balls break. And he's looking for the <laughs> and areas. He's all right. and he's, there you go. I mean, he's, this is what he's known for, uh, as well as being a, you know, a world-class professional player. And it, mm -hmm. on his first break, making the two and the four in the side pocket uh, is going to tell you uh, that he's got the, the best of his game going on right now. This one's one of those subtle shots that he's just gone a hair too far because he wanted to go two rails around for the six mm -hmm. ball in the corner pocket, in the right corner pocket as we see it. But uh, he actually went farther, and now he has to, wow, can he cut this ball in and not scratch and come straight yeah, down the table? On the six. It yeah. looks it. I think for him <laughs> it's not going to be a problem because surely this isn't where, if he had ball in hand, this is what I tell a lot of my, my players, that if you have ball in hand, where would you want to put it? And I don't think that's where he wanted to put it. And Definitely not in the oh. jaws. Well, no. of course, after shooting, you know, but he got perfect on the six. Yeah, hey. he got perfect shape on the six. Doesn't he get points for that? <laughs> you yeah, should, right? He's going to get a pointer in a little while, but I'll tell you what, <laughs> this is no easy shot for anybody. No, that, no. Th that, that ball is deep in the jaws. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a lot of times people who want to like short kick this one going to the rail first on a diamond table, you can miss the whole ball. He's drawing out of it. I don't think he's going to the rail. He's, oh, drawing, he's just wow. drawing. That was yeah. just incredibly. Look at the speed control. Wow. Just like he had a pencil in his hand. I'll tell you what, he drew that ball <laughs> back beautifully. And what the, a tough crowd we have. And the crowd there. must be going crazy <laughs> because they were just stunned. Absolutely yeah, silent was... crickets. Not even, it was so silent there was no crickets. That that shot. Let's just keep on talking about that shot yeah. because we might as well. That was a world class shot. That was right a great Are you kidding ball. me? Yeah. We just want to mention that Torsten Holman is also sponsored by Lucasi Hybrid Cues. As you can see, he's wearing the patches. I do see the patches. Man. He's sporting all black today. He mm -hmm. said upstate. Yeah, he had the German colors on yesterday. Yeah, yeah, he was. He was sporting them. Yeah. Toasty is running around the table. He can't get these balls fast enough. Well, just how he does it. That's right. Looks like one nothing. The former, the man formerly known as the Hitman, yep. Toasty Holman. And if the match is going to proceed with this tempo and should end early, <laughs> we're going to switch you over to Mike DeShane and Sean Wilkie. That game has started over there as well. I'm not sure who the, who sat in the back. Is that Vivian playing Jennifer Beretta behind this table? Yeah, it is. I wish we could take a look closer look so we can tell for sure. But first, I believe that is Vivian. And yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yep. And that is most definitely Jennifer Beretta. Yes. I can't tell you how many years I know. A lot of people are intimidated by Jennifer because of her beauty and her great to approach her. She's such a sweetheart. And I know her yeah. husband, too, very well. But uh, she's a easy to look at. Meanwhile, back in this match here. Sorry for taking <laughs> We were all just drifting just away. Drifting to the right side here, but <laughs> take a deep breath and one nothing Toasty Homan to break. Switching to the, the oblique angle. You know, that's such a statement to make right there to beat sure. your opponent on his rack. On his rack, because <laughs> this is alternating break. Yeah. First, and uh, hit his ball a little flatter and didn't yeah. get up in the air and subsequently got kicked really <laughs> quickly. And the one ball's hanging. Yeah. 
What do you like here, Steve? You like going to the inside of that seven ball, or yeah, probably floating all around all around the five. Partial inside, probably just inside English. I mean, it looks like he's coming around the the five and the old school five way. seven, old school yeah. way around the five. Bef Two, three rails. Oh, he caught the. Mm -hmm. he's, he's still got a shot here, yeah. but he did catch a ball here, and then he looks like he's okay. But you know he that this that pattern is the old school pattern before right. we ha before everybody had uh, low deflection cues. That one was an automatic outside uh, shot. Yeah. And only the three or four people who could really play with inside English would shoot the inside shot. Yeah, that inside English is dangerous. You know, you can't say that to the Filipinos, though. You oh, know, yeah, that yeah, contingent yeah. came over, and they, they shoot eight-foot shots with high, so, so much velocity of inside spin. And to compensate for the distance, it's so hard. But right. it's like mm -hmm. a natural. Right, and the jacket up, half half Masse, 1996, Francisco Bustamante, inside English, half Masse beats Earl Strickland in the finals. Speaking like of jacking nothing. up, you jack up a little bit Jacked like up that. there. Crowd goes crazy, you hear them. <laughs> what a great shot. Everything's tough here. The, the four to the six is tough. I mean, four to the five is tough. Yeah, the six is, is lays tough. On the wrong side. I mean, he's got some traffic down there. He has to avoid to back down for the five. Follow with two rails. Oh, oh and he, got, he put too much on there and got caught up in the rail. And, and of course, just completely punished for it. Yeah. Double punished. That yeah. cue ball could have been anywhere, but it decided behind the eight was good after hitting the uh, the point. That's just ball. lovely. We're going airborne, guys. Here comes the old yeah. jump cue, yeah. We need a jump cue sponsor for to talk about this one. I'm not sure who's made the uh, who made the jumper for Donnie Mills. I'm really not sure. Anybody know? Go ahead and say their name. <laughs> but uh, Steve Lomax makes a, one hell of a great jump mm, cue. Yeah. Just, just, I'm just going to mention one name. Just mention that name, like yeah, there. Steve's not a sponsor. Of mine. Reverse I just sponsorship. Like his workmanship, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Again, it's not exactly laying open or anything. Maybe Toasty's looking at the uh, carom off the six into the ten. Mm -hmm. Not bad, you know. Play that. Play it all the way. If you're going to play that, commit to it. I see a lot of people playing this, like playing the five ball, saying, well, if I happen to get here, I'll do this. If yeah. I happen to get there, I'll do that. Commit to one shot. Yeah, wrong thing to do when you're downstroking, mm -hmm. that's for sure. It's beautiful, shot. beautiful, useful. I think he's into a huge call, but look at, look at the camera and the ten ball. I think so. You know, if it is not on, the only other thing I can see here is just uh, bunting the six ball back, uh, straight back, the cue ball crawling forward onto the ten ball, but for mm -hmm. sure he's playing the ten ball. Yeah. It yeah. didn't go. Yep. And it's open. I think Donnie Mills can make the I think solid this ball in. Yeah, I think he tried to play the two-way there. He wanted to get the six past Up the side, side right, yeah. a little bit, but he didn't quite get there. That's another yeah. thing, and, and if that's what he did, I, it feels like he really should have committed all the way to the ten and forget about the six ball because you're trying to win the game there. You're not trying to give the table back. Mm -hmm. Because yeah. look, so look what's happened here. Surely he can saw this in. Did you say Shirley? Yes, I did. All right. Yeah, I understand exactly where you're coming from. And I don't think Toasty, yeah. being the season player that he is, went down there with two things on the Yeah, mind, I know? think so. I think he just just missed that. He probably had that two-way shot planned from the, the get-go. Yeah. It and, you know, it's not the first time that it'll come up either that he saw it. Yeah. I think one of the things, problems Donnie's having here is that you can actually make, you can thump the six ball past the seven uh, in the corner pocket or the side pocket. Mm -hmm. if, if you were only given one choice, you'd, sh you'd already shoot it. Yeah. The problem was yeah. trying to hold the cue ball right. at the right. right. up top or come down all the way like this. And oh. this is and trouble. And to rail. that point, yeah. he's, he's, he's hit it long. Yep. What do you do here? You slow roll this and, and, and take what you can get with the eight ball? I think yeah, that's it, I don't, right? Yeah, I don't really want to fire at this too hard because you can over amp this ball and the seven don't have to go in the corner. You better right. make sure you Make sure you make it. Yeah. Just cinch make sure you cinch make the it. ball and take what you get with the eight ball. No, he went from the hey, round to yeah. get good. And yeah. This is no good. That's very costly right there. I think so. Yeah. I think everybody listening and everybody sitting in this booth right now would bet against Dawson not getting out. <laughs> yeah. 
Well, we can invent a reason why he'd, he'd have a problem here. He did shake his head just a hair because he was on the right side of the eight ball, but there shouldn't be any problem. No. Draw back to the third diamond. No, he's got a really, really good cue ball right I now. wish I had his problems right now. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. His cue ball control is awesome right now. Two nothing. Yep. I don't remember when his cue ball control wasn't awesome. That's, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, he, even when he wasn't one of the top players in the world, he his cue ball control is awesome. I do remember Shane's though. A couple of years ago, I think he went to China and Japan. I forget. It was it was like a tour, and then he wound up in uh, <laughs> uh, uh, Dubai, and then he came back and he played in the Turning Stone, and he had so much jet lag. Yeah. He, mm. You know, anybody could have played him. You could have been somebody in high school mm -hmm. and beat him, and yeah. he would be the first one to tell you about it. He could not make a ball. <laughs> wow. His eyes were the color of that carpet that you look at <laughs> right there. I'm serious. He was in bad shape. Wow. I think he went two and out. That's tough. Shane Van Boney, yeah. Well, you know, it happens. You know, and then uh, you, when you get to travel like these guys, <laughs> yeah. talk about physical shape. Yeah. Better be in physical shape. That's because this game is physical, no and matter then, what anybody thinks. And then eating the different foods, you know. Right. But mm -hmm. It's got to play exactly. a role. Well, meanwhile, Donnie Mills made three balls in the break, dead straight on the one. <laughs> the four ball went into the, the, to the side pocket. I don't know what the six ball is doing. I think the six ball is giving him headaches here. He's got the head shake going on looking at that six. Yep. He'd hate to play the 6-10 combination here, but uh, when he gets to it, but it looks like he has to look at it. Right. Yeah, it certainly looks like this whole this whole. Uh, Freddie, you game know is, uh, uh, Kerry McAuliffe. Uh, we got KM run out. Kerry McAuliffe coming up. <laughs> Kerry from Massachusetts, <laughs> my state here. Uh, my hero. <laughs> we're good, Kerry. Oh, he's on third. There I am. There we go. Hey, guys. Carrie, have you uh, watched Donnie Mills much? I know that you've come down to Florida a few times to, to play uh, yep. the U.S. Amateur Championship as you've qualified the last several years to come down. Uh, yeah, I have actually had the opportunity to watch him a few times. He, he even, uh, I watched him play a set against one of the guys that was in the tournament, uh, and yeah. he was giving up ridiculous weight and beating the guy. It was quite impressive. He's breaking amazing. <laughs> yeah, he's breaking amazing. I mean, he, uh, he always does, I guess. And, and it's a rack your own, uh, and I, and I, I don't want to make light of that, but uh, oh. people know Donnie as, as a very good uh, rack reader. So uh, I don't think it's any secret. It's no secret. No. It's no secret. No. You still got to hit the rack You still got to hit the rack good, and you still got to know what you're doing, and in the end, uh, he still has to make shots on the rest of the, uh, the, you know, the layout. And it looks like that 6-10 that combination is... Probably what he's kind of forced to shoot. I don't think the six passed the ten. No, I think it's blocked too. Doesn't really lay too bad for a combo if you can get reasonably towards the center of the table. Yeah, it's funny because you say that, and I, I agree. But he's playing, you know, a world champion, and you want it wide open. <laughs> you don't want any, any not, reason to have to bank or combo that. or anything like that. Well, he's fighting against a couple of little errors. So yeah, he's already made too. a couple of right. Well, he's playing it here. No, he's playing the safe, and that oh, might be the smartest the thing to do. Ball. Yep. How do you do? I think he's going to shake his head here. Ball. Yeah, we don't have a great angle on it, but he didn't shake his head, and he didn't kind of. Yep. Yeah, he, he got him. Yeah. <laughs> he He's got him. Going back for the jump cue, I think. From here. Or even a... That'd be the quick jump, bank the six, yeah. and one rail out to the side of the table. Yep, there it is. What a shot. 76% of the people viewing saying, I hate jump cues <laughs> just for this. He's jump banking his ball. Jump banking. Yeah, yeah. yeah if not, he would be playing a two rail kick. Yeah, it's there's four things happening on this, I think. If Q ball to the center of the table is 
is probably right in the six and ball out, and he's saying he, it's a foul. He nudged the seven ball, I think, on the jump. Oh, really? okay. Well, whatever it was, he, he gave it up, and of course, yep. the that six is not easy. He's got to shoot it up table. Yep. Obviously, Donnie was supposed to make this, but and he should be happy to be back at the table. I'd be going crazy. It is actually kind of <laughs> awkward because he can't just roll forward. Exactly, exactly. And, and when you're feeling <laughs> pressure, I tell you, when you're feeling pressure and yeah, yeah, that that is the new clean cloth uh, make right there. He missed yep. that by about a diamond. Mm -hmm. So he gets, he's got to get on the board to you know, get off the jitters. Assuming he has jitters. Yeah, I don't think he <laughs> shakes. To no. be honest with you, Freddie. Yeah. Yeah, actually, I think I remember uh, several years back he did real, real well at Turning Stone. He might have got second or third or fourth. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's done great. He's done very well in, in a couple of the major tournaments, Turning Stone, U.S. Open. Two to one, Torsten Holman breaking. Let's see how he does this. his break. He hit it a little bit flat last time. Go ahead. Everybody here is a... <laughs> Has a check yet? <laughs> Everybody here has a check yet. It's yeah. pretty good stuff. We're it all is, in the same is. plane. I had check my, my first one last night, and I have to say, I felt pretty fantastic. Pretty good. Afterwards. Pretty good. Yeah. You know, yeah. I mean, I've I've walked into this uh, this event feeling perfect, and I think I feel more perfect now with a check yeah. in me. What do yeah. you think? <laughs> well, well, wait a minute. As forty minutes goes by, forty-five minutes, you're going to notice the focus on it. I, I that's the effect I'm feeling. I don't. I do not take mm -hmm. anything. Yeah. When it comes to any kind of drugs, I do not take them. Right. right. If I, if I have an infection that and it gets so bad, I got to take an antibiotic. I will. Other than that, I don't take anything. So whatever I use really affects me nicely. Right. And right. I mean, not nicely, but affects me to where it's supposed to do. It's, I'm this on the same page me. as you, yeah. Al. Okay, there you go. Yep. So give it 40 minutes, you'll be focused even more than what you are now, Freddie. Mm, not, not saying nice. you're not focused. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, Torsten Holman breaks the ball. He, he broke them from the left side this time. He broke the balls from the right side previously. Uh, he didn't get a clean club on it, but he did make balls. And you can see the pattern tells you that he didn't really hit him yeah. so clean. So well, it is rack your own, so. Yeah. Can't blame anybody but himself. Right. He racked his own, he hit his own, and uh, not as cleanly as Donnie Mills' break, but. Right. It's pretty interesting position here. I don't yeah. know if he can actually make can his he balls. Go he did around the 4 8. <laughs> I don't even know if he can make the two. Never mind. I know. Four. Four. Well, I, I think he played he fine to make the two. Well, what does he do with it? it. <laughs> yeah. Maybe, you know, if he can just get enough of the two uh, to yeah. possibly cut it into the rail. I don't know what he's all trying to nine. After he shoots this, we're going to wonder why we even question he's it. He's banking it and playing safe behind the three. Yeah. This is a two way here. Watch this. Uh, oh, he, he, he played the shot. Played the shot. Yeah. I think he was trying to play it off the nine. This is a mess. Yeah. This it whole is. rack is a mess. <laughs> Yeah, everything down that well was mo mostly down the end of the table except for the nine, for the most part. I think it's what I was saying before. You know, Donnie Mills wants these balls to be open, and he comes to the table yeah. after a, a, a really bad break by uh, Torsten, and then a weird miss. And this, you'd think it's so easy, except for the fact that he can't shoot a ball straight. You know, it looks like the two-six combination and the cue ball. You float it down and hope yeah. the two ball gets far enough so that he. Sh not hooked behind the 10. He's got a small yeah, window back there to play yeah. with. It, it, you can't play safe here, I don't think. The 2-6 is too good to, sh to not shoot at. Uh, there you at, you at called it. It's, it's perfect. perfect. Yeah. You know? And he makes it look so easy, but you know what? It, as amateurs, we set that up a few times, and how many times are we going to get <laughs> so nice like that? Well, Kerry, you're going to get there, but uh, me, <laughs> that's another question. <laughs> one out of 10. Maybe. Okay, one out of 10. <laughs> And e even this is a pretty nice shot because that yeah, nine ends up being nice. huge. <laughs> yeah. The internet stream is probably thinking, oh, what is he talking about? Everybody can make that. Everybody can get there. Everybody Such a can. small window. Yeah, right? no, yeah, every shot's so easy on the screen, right? Right. Four to the eight is his uh, most tricky, but after he gets that, surely he's out. Yeah, he's going to go to the rail here and just yep. hold position to shoot the eight in the upper right hand. I like what he's doing up. there because he wanted to make sure the angle doesn't take the cue ball to the eight, uh, to the ten ball after when he's hitting the eight ball. 
Let's just float forward, maybe even get to the rail. Yep. Yeah. Get on that line. Yep. Make sure he doesn't hit the uh, the ten ball here. And if he's dead straight, then he draws. I think he has some angle. I think he can just. I think he just stun it. Up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Stun it to like the stun middle of the table. There, I think so. Towards the. Uh, yep. Perfect. Yeah. Nice it up. Actually, he might have liked to have come a little further. Yeah. But at this point, he can just. I think he, he's just at a stop shot yeah, here. Probably. Even if he, f if even if he had to flow yeah. forward, he's not going to go crazy for sure. He, c I mean, he could just slow roll and take the longer shot. I think he just looked to see where he wanted to be on the ten. Yeah, and you're exactly right because he would never have walked over there if he was at the right angle. Right. He was definitely at the wrong angle. Forward by about a foot, I guess. Yeah, and they just take the cut. Yeah. Oh. Yep. And I think that's the definitely the right way to go. Yep. Don't create a problem when you're already at the solution. What do you think about that saying, Carrie? Eh? Put that one there. <laughs> <laughs> Sounded like a good one. <laughs> Donnie Mills tying it up. Ties the match. And he's breaking. Two to two. This is game five. Got our tech team going here. Getting the score right. Two to two now. So this is alternating break, right? Alternating break. Yep. Rack your own. So, so far, Donnie Mills has broke twice, and he's made five balls. Mm -hmm. It'd be an interesting count. You know how they do that sometimes here at the Super Billiards Expo, where you can put a dollar up or two for three shots and see how many balls you can make uh, commutative. Usually I have a negative score. But <laughs> and there you go for all those uh, who want to learn how to make the so rack the tight, switch the bottom two corner balls. <laughs> There's no um, rule about where the two and three have no, to be? No, no apparently not. And uh, it's interesting you say that, uh, Carrie, because I, I played some tournaments recently, which is a shock right there. And uh, they all had that 2-3 rule in the back. Yeah. yeah. And they talk as if that's the standard. And I say, um, I, I've not seen that rule down, but I do see it a lot, yeah. the 2-3 in the back. I the think in the in the book, like the, the world they standardized show it. 10 ball rules, I think, have the 2 and 3 maybe, in the corners. I could be wrong. Right? Maybe that's it. I know that in the 9 ball, they used to have the 2-3 yeah. and maybe even the 4 in uh, specific spots, and people thought they were supposed to be there, but it was just for illustration purposes, well, I don't know. Apparently switching those two back corner balls prevented him from making the second ball on the side. Exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. Something happened there because yep. Yep. he now is in not in the running for most balls on three breaks. Mm -hmm. uh, he may he still at be, five. That's true, five <laughs> is an awful lot. Five is an awful lot. Tough first shot here to get uh, if the two doesn't pass the five. If it does, then he just slides this one ball in. Make it sound so e simple, you know. Yeah. Like, yeah, just you know, put that in the center of the pocket. It's a great two, shot. The two ball must pass the five. Right. Oh, he just. <laughs> I like. He I just like winced a little exactly bit. Exactly. <laughs> like I should have looked. <laughs> I should have looked. I heard the commentators talk about that inside English shot, uh, outside English shot. Was that what was I supposed to do? <laughs> I like going outside myself, but. Yeah, he yeah. Nice shot. There it is. Well, that was a really nice shot. Now you just that draw it nice. straight back. Where's the four ball? Is that the in the four side pocket? Down by the ten? Is it no, the, the seven ball? No, it's the seven the ball. Right That's the seven ball. He, he unfortunately got a little flat on this yeah. ball. So maybe just to uh, sort of stop it right around there so you can bunt the four ball in, come across the table. Yeah. Because you can't get off the rail. Oh, okay, yeah. Or he can get off the rail by a couple of inches. Mm -hmm. In the background, we have Jennifer Beretta, for those of you watching, if you couldn't figure it out. And it looks like he solved this rack. Yeah. Five yeah. to the six is easy. I'm always going two rails forward on this one. What do you guys think? I like that too. Yep. He'll probably just play one though, to be honest. His speed control is so good. I know. Oh, I guess I he know. Two. See that? Yeah. He heard me. I. It was a time. You automatically get the right line. <laughs> right. On the six ball. Right. Exactly. He'd 
like to replace the cue ball, the six ball with the cue ball, but I guess you can get below the seven if you wanted to. So you don't want to get too flat there. That might there. not be ideal. Right. He's real straight. It's real straight, but he's he winced. He got the wince. Yeah. <laughs> if he's straight enough, he can just right. come back to the rail and out. Yeah. With a professional stroke. Yep. But which he has. He's, he's gonna <laughs> pound this. He's then he's following this. See how much he's pounding. Oh, oh wow. my yeah, goodness. So we got it right there. I yeah. mean, uh, you know, he really did want to replace the six with the one, and he went forward too yeah. far, and came up flat, and that was quite. Let's say he doesn't get caught up in the corner. Where does that ball go? Yeah, I'm not too sure. One, yeah, two, yeah, three rails yeah. to the uh, to the left side of the eight, and then out. That's but possible. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. But here, I almost feel like he could go up and around the temple with inside. I think that's what he's doing. Ooh. Uh, he yeah, so he really screwed mm. up on the where he, where he lost it there was the six ball shot. Mm -hmm. Well, if he can just stick this bank. <laughs> Again, he's, you know, he, he's at the table. He, he really wants to think dead straight in. That's a nice That's bank. About as good as you can hit it. Yeah, yep. Boom. Good shot. Very nice. Very surprised that uh, Homan didn't get out there. He'd, he'd already solved the rack uh, getting to the five ball. Donnie Mel's going to take the lead. Yep. Three to two. Three to two. I'd be curious to know if Donnie plays with a standard length cue. He's a pretty tall He's guy. He's a pretty tall guy with long arms. Yeah, and it, and it, it looks kind of natural in his hand, so I'm just wondering uh, if it's a longer cue or what. We're going to guess it is and then go forward with that. Because <laughs> you're right. Uh, it doesn't look small in his hands. It looks, it looks right for him. What is uh, Torsen playing with? This is his break cue? Um, I think that's his playing cue. I, I think he plays with Lucasi. Hmm. And I take it it's not ivory. No, it's uh, some kind of composite material or something. I've actually hit with that cue. With his or, um, or the, not or his, but with the same one. Okay. And I know he has their uh, big Beulah break cue. Again, Torsten made balls in the break last time, but he didn't hit him exactly good. And I know he's got a pretty good break, so we got to control the cue ball. Oh, lost it to the left. Yeah. It didn't scratch. The ball yeah, went in. I thought ball, I was yeah. watching it go off the table. That's what I thought. I think it went airborne. I thought it was off the table. Off <laughs> the table. It must have landed right on the nose. Yep. Safety coming up. Key ball stuck to the three, I expose. Yeah. Thinking, yep. He trails three to two. It's his break, so uh, he needs to win this one or else Donnie Mills gets a chance to stretch the lead. They stuck him behind the five. Hmm. Honestly, that was not probably not as strong as he could have played. No. Well, I think the kick on this is not as easy because he's got to stretch out a little bit, but it is a one, like rail, one rail kick. Yeah. You can almost see the edge of this ball. <laughs> A nice hit. You might stuck up behind the three on that kick. Right I don't know what you do from here. Well, I think if you bank it and keep the cue ball down the center of the tail, you're always on the two. And then the right. two ball, uh, one ball goes one rail across and you know, dying on the end rail if you miss. Oh, he has a shot on this. What am I talking uh, about? I yeah. didn't, I didn't think he could even all. see it. Neither did I. Hmm. Well, that's one of those commentator things. You can't see the ball so well. And he had it straight in. In fact, he had more. No, he undercut it just a hair. So he probably if hit it as he much as he could. kick this ball out and stick the cue ball right there, that could work. That's a good shot. Yeah. Almost looks like he's thinking combo. I think he's playing what you said. I think he's just kicking. Oh. 
Looked like he was aiming to kick from behind. Well, maybe he'll play the 2-9 combination, think, think he wins, and then accidentally rack up their balls. <laughs> I guess the only question he's thinking is whether or not he puts the two out of there or puts the cue out of there. I like the kick shot. Personally. I yeah, like the cue kick shot too. Also. And the cue ball will crawl forward. Yeah, that's, there, that's perfect. That's a nice shot right there. That perfect. 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 Yeah, the crowd really appreciates it. You heard them. You heard him. <laughs> you heard one person. <laughs> that was a, such a great shot. Yeah. But Donnie's looking at this like he has a one rail kick. I wouldn't think that yeah. he would have. Yeah, I thought he almost, I thought he almost froze that to the nine ball. <laughs> well, he, definitely he definitely had the one rail kick. Went but two scratched. rails and then the drink. That comes up a lot when that ball's off the rail like that. Yep. Here's Thorson's chance to tie this up. <laughs> the only awkward thing is from the three to the four. Right, because the six ball, he's not supposed to be in trouble, but. <laughs> For me, um, I'm thinking get the cue ball at the center of the table. Don't even flirt with the six. But uh, right. yeah, see where he's pointing there. Then that's yeah. where I'm thinking that angle. So play this as if you're you want to run into the ten ball, but come up short. Mm. Don't flirt with the six. Oh. Wow. And he oh did, I and the yeah, six flirts back. Got him. Yep. <laughs> he didn't shake his head. No, he maybe got, he just maybe he got just there. Just just got there? Yeah, he didn't. Wow, yeah, he did. Yeah. I thought for a second he was hooked. Well, it certainly looked like he was going that way, but you can always tell yeah. by the player's reaction. All right. Had he gotten hooked by the six, the standard reaction is a nod, <laughs> a quick nod. <laughs> right. It wouldn't have been a, oh my goodness, can't believe it, because he knew he hit it bad. Mm -hmm. Thorson is shooting fast, and I know he's a fast dish player, but it almost looks like he's running around the table. It's that athleticism. <laughs> he, he's, a, he's a workout type of guy, so. Yeah. Three to three. They're looking at Allison Fisher in the background there, too. Way in the background. Yeah, I think she's two in tables the, down. In the blue, yeah. I think it's Monica Webb, I believe. I think it's Monica Webb in the pink. I cannot think. I don't think that's Monica, but I don't see her. Whoever that is, I don't see her moving. No. I don't believe that's how Monica walks. Oh. I don't think Monica would wear a hooded pink shirt like that. <laughs> well, there we go. It's game number seven. All tied. Donnie Mills breaking. Watch the two and the four. Oh, he hit that harder, and the four just missed. Pretty solid break, but they came up dry. He hit that more solid than he has in yeah. the past. So. And yeah, he probably was the problem. The four ball came up uh, you know, short. It's two to the three is pretty tricky here. I think he's going to draw this two inches. Mm -hmm. I wonder, does he go all the way down around the nine ball? Well, that's what I thought he was going to do, but he's, he needed to draw a little bit more on the cue ball to get to get that. So I think he's going to go plowing forward towards the seven yeah. ball. A little inside English. Yeah. Two rails towards the seven. Yeah. That's, and that's a nice shot. That is a great shot. And he's behind the ten. Boy, that's that is really unfortunate because if he'd hit the seven, oh. he's in. Wow. 
ball. You mentioned reactions. I think this one he can. I think this three ball, three ball he cannot see. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't give the nod because that was a little, that was really unfortunate that he didn't yeah, I tickle. I think he can hit this ball. He's going to tie yeah. up the four and six. Yep. That's what he did. And Intentionally a foul. Not too bad. Not bad at all. If if Donnie can draw underneath the six and bump the four ball, <laughs> he, he might come out okay. <laughs> That's asking quite a lot. What do you think? I mean, if you were left-handed, if you were well, right-handed, yeah. We so were saying how he's tall. He can reach yeah. That's true. That's true. Yeah, he might be able to do this. Even even if he just goes yeah. square into the six, the four gets bumped sure. up towards the corner. Yeah. That's not bad. I do like your first one, though. Draw it right by the six ball. Why not? Sure. I'm sorry, guys. What's the score here? Three to three. Oh, you updated the score. Thank you, Stevie. You know, that was 92% uh. perfect. Now, does this uh, pro tournament allow jump cubes? Yes. Yes, yes it does. Yes. Yeah, it's in stereo. Kind of almost an optimal jump. <laughs> yeah. As jumps go. See, now that he shot the ball, I can say why I wouldn't have shot that like that. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm trying to kick this in. Kick it in. If it's hanging, he's good. Nice uh, yeah. one. He's asking for a roll. And he uh, got, he's got one. there. He's got a left-hander's roll, though. And but being that close, he's not that bad of a left-handed shooter. Okay, now that's a really funny thing to see at a pro tournament. Am I looking at a coin-op mechanism on that table? Sure, this is a smart table, nine-foot smart table. Interesting. Yeah. yeah. These yeah. tables come up, uh, they were used at the Derby City Classic. Yeah. Oh, yeah? yeah? Yeah. So the Pro-Am tables and the smart uh, tables are exactly the same, except for the coin-op mechanism is <laughs> put on there. Everything else is exactly the same. And the cue ball optical density sensor? Yeah, the optical density <laughs> sensor. It's light oh. optical density. Light passes through, to and through, transmission right through the cue ball. And uh, there's a sensor on the other side that reads how much light is coming through the cue ball. That's a pretty great invention, I got to say. I, yeah, you know, it's, it's one of those things that all of the technology was out there. It just needed to be applied into something like this. You know, Great job of uh, Greg Sullivan and the Diamond team for that. It was amazing when they put that video out. I don't know how many people hit that video. The video? I'd hit that. Yeah, <laughs> I hit it too. <laughs> Stun follow here for the seven ball in the side pocket, and he will solve this yep. this, uh, this rack. Which way you like going on here? The nine ball has to go to the bottom right, so. I never get thrilled with that playing to the side pocket on late in a rack when you have the corner pocket to play to. He might have come up a little short on this ball. He might have to go to the to the, the to, it, to the bottom side and spin with inside across. I can't yeah. tell how straight he is. Yeah, because it doesn't take much to be out of line going to the side pocket like that. That's why you don't never want to play like that for eight ball. Yeah. Because usually there's a whole bunch of other balls on the, t on the table that block you. But I don't know why it opened right. That was a great great shot, great stroke. Inside English on the wrong side of the table. Bring it back. Is he drawing to the rail? Oh no, he's gonna play in the side pocket. I guess that's interesting. It was there? Why not? You see, if you're playing an Earl Strickland's new table, <laughs> you couldn't shoot that shot. Nope. This is exactly <laughs> why Earl Strickland said no side pockets, no. F Funny backup <laughs> plans there. <laughs> and wired second balls on the break. Yeah, that's yeah. right. No, <laughs> no two balls, no Shane Van Boning break into the second. You know, <laughs> the person I credit with showing the whole world that is uh, Joe Tucker. Joe Tucker's yeah. Racking mm -hmm. Secrets yep. showed that second ball in the side pocket for years. That's been out there for yeah. years, and Joe mm -hmm. Tucker that showed everybody. In the 90s. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> right? That's crazy. All right. And I remember back then when he came out with that book, it, it said right in the book, uh, I think 10 ball is going to be the way things go. In fact, Joe Tucker, uh, his, his email address uh, was uh, JT10ball for yeah, years. It <laughs> still is. <Yeah. laughs> I think he's down here. I saw him the yes. other day. Yes, yep, he, is. he is. Four to three, Donnie Mills. Thorsten Holman is now going back to the right side where he initially started. 
Much better break that yeah, time. That one a lot better. But nope. The ten the ball. Is five ball. Now with the ten ball, no, you don't have to call the ten ball. The ten no. ball doesn't, doesn't count if it goes right. In any yeah. pocket, right? Okay. In any pocket. Good. Right. good, 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 good. But you don't have to call it, and you can make it early. Correct. You don't have to call it. Right. Smacking around a table at nine hundred yeah, miles. Yeah, that's what I like. <laughs> yeah. Because that's what everybody does. <laughs> Amateurs. <laughs> But if it does happen to go in, it will be a win. Mm -hmm. Donnie Mills looks intense. Take yeah. a look at Donnie Mills. He's right ready. Side of your monitor yeah. there. He's, he's intense. Mm -hmm. That's right. In a wigwam and a teepee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> intense for those internet uh, streamer listeners if they didn't catch that one. Oh, I thought you were referring to, to two tenths. <laughs> You're right there, Jerry. <laughs> that's You're true. right on cue. <laughs> that's the that's book that Tom McGonagall wrote. That's right. <laughs> well, I think I'm, I need another check you out. <laughs> check you out. One of our sponsors, a liquid mm -hmm. multivitamin. Well, combination from eight and a half feet away. Looks yep. like it's... You know, this is yeah. a key shot of this rack right here. Sure. Everything, yeah, else, everything you know, is everything is wide open, right? It's a race to the six ball if, you, if somebody wants to play the 6-10 combination. Yeah. So you, you might not have to play that far. So this could be a key shot. I'd play the combination all day long, uh, but uh, maybe a safety might be a good idea. Watch the eight here. He didn't even touch the eight. Yeah, let's see, that's one more gets away from him. This is a cuttable shot for a right hander. Definitely though. for a right hander, exactly right, Al. I mean, Does even as short as I am, I could make this one, or at least I could hit it. Right. Up and down the table. Yeah. Making sure you're on the ball, and he is. And here we go. I think here he may uh, go around the nine ball. Inside. I think so. Comes up to a nice angle on the four. Yeah, and you put a hair of spin on there because you don't want this flat coming off that rail. Perfect. Yeah, that that good. Perfect. Yeah, that should be a nice angle to just get out dead straight on that yeah. combo. Mm -hmm. He could do anything he want here. And like I mean, actually, if he really wanted to, I think he could play, play position, below, uh, roll across, and play yeah. the six in the same pocket. Yep, true. He could you know, do not that. Even, not he even could play do that. He absolutely could uh, do that. And now he might do it too. And now, mm -hmm. now that he has that angle, now he's he, he, too many choices now. No, yep. that's exactly cross right. table. Said, perfect. Um, that makes the odds are a lot better of him running out. I mean, not that it's not an easy combo for him, but yeah. And I guess really the question is whether or not the six to the eight was any worse than six ten combination. Mm. Uh, seven to the eight. I'm sorry, seven yeah. to the eight versus six, six ten combination. Awkward, yeah. All, all the way to the rail now. <coughs> See, I'm not sure I like mm -hmm. this because now this is. Mm -hmm. He's okay. In the corner He's and draw back a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah. He needs an angle. Right. So I think you just you know play it in the corner and draw back. But like I said, I mean the pattern. Gives then the angle. The pattern makes. Was that is the pattern any easier he than the six ten? <laughs> I think <laughs> he has the angle to shoot this in the side and draw to the left side rail. It looks like he's straight enough that he can do that. Well, here we go. Yep. Oh, wow. Nice shot. He's got to go. Too he's straight. Oh, he's actually. No, he's good. He went past good. the angle. Yeah, he's actually on the other side of the angle, which either angle works as long as you have angle. Exactly. He didn't he think too hard on that. Bit and now nice. He came out nice on that shot. Well, he is about to take a two-game lead, and I believe he, uh, he will be breaking. He will be. It will be an odd game. Hmm. Interesting how he hit that one. He with the one that one high checkup English. I guess that's the only way he could have gone. Mm -hmm. huh. There you go. So what are we getting? A five-three. Five-three. Two-game lead. Donnie Mills to break. Game number nine. Let's 
see if he can figure out how to get back to the first couple of breaks. I know. Here. Well, he's hit him harder. The last time he hit him harder. And uh, let's see if he remembers. First two breaks he had, he had to combine five balls on the break. The last two he has, he has none now. It's all evening out. Runner to tell us who uh, Allison is playing in the background because uh, I've gone back and forth. I'm thinking, no, that can't be Monica. Yes, that is Monica. No, it is not. Sure, it is. I thought it was, but I. <laughs> I can't tell. All right, what night? Oh, oh yeah, a kicks. ball got kicked in the side. Cue ball got kicked by the. Oh, by the, the two ball. Eight. So the a ball that got kicked in the side was uh, the white one. Yep, the one that got kicked was the. All right, Carrie, thank you for joining us here. We're gonna get the jazz man back in. It is Janet. Oh. It is. Oh, it is. Oh, oh, of course, Janet Atwell. Wow. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. All right. We can't well, see well. from way over here. It's <laughs> just, yeah, a couple, it's just a figure in the background moving. I cheated. I took a look at the brackets. No, we, and we <laughs> needed to. We, you know, it was bothering me enough that I had to ask for a runner to go get, get us the answer there. So, <laughs> so then we knew. Looks like we got, got a good match here with uh, Donnie and Thorsten, huh? Yeah, that's uh, great. Donnie Mills uh, up 5-3. to three. A couple of uh, position errors oh. by Thorsten has, uh, has let Donnie come get to that lead and another one here position error the five to the six is no no picnic no, no. bargain i think he's a little a little straighter than he wanted to be here on this ball he's a little bit so much straighter that he's on the wrong side yeah. of this ball he's gonna just draw out he's center of the table he's gonna watch get everybody that. wrong yep. how about that perfect that's a great shot look how, look how easy that shot was you know something, he lives yeah. in the united states he lives in florida he's got to play for the moscone cup team <laughs> in the usa i think so yeah we, see, we should get uh, him and, him and, and Jason Shaw, Shaw exactly, yeah. on our team. Well, um, Jason's another story. He can't, but yeah. uh, Dawson's you know, been I, here for a while. I tell you, for you know, a few years back when he was winning just about every Everything. major championship and then he didn't make the yeah, most. I, I, was, I, was I was shocked. I was shocked. <laughs> yeah. But that was the year that they wanted all the MVPs to come back, wasn't That's it? Right. Yeah, That's right. That's right. Uh, was it the 20th uh, anniversary, I think something, it was? Yeah. Something of that nature, yeah. yeah. Did Jason uh, apply for citizenship? He does. He, he does, he but he has something. to be uh, for so many years before he can actually qualify. To right, 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 right. Yeah. I think it's five, five, five years. Yeah. Five years, yep. yeah. <coughs> but he, you know, he's open to anybody. But right now he's in Europe. He's going to be there for about three months. He's playing yep. on the European tours and he's playing on all the Moscone Point Cup team. Uh, ranking uh, tournaments. Mm -hmm. I was talking to Darren yesterday. In fact, we were on the air, and Darren says, I can't see Jason not making it. This right. Year. Uh, I agree with him completely. He, yeah. Jason's playing phenomenal right now. Another funny shot by Torsten. He uh, overran position without coming back he's up, so he's got to cut and have the cue ball a little bit loose so up and down the table. Stun this, just come the one rail. He's got so yeah. much there it is. You know, so much empty space to work with that that shot right. that was like that's a right. Yeah. Exactly. But on the other hand, he's down five to three. He doesn't need to yeah. be shooting anything more difficult than a, uh, a level two yeah, right. from a scale from <laughs> one to 50. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know? But he doesn't mind. He'll take that. He'll start from there every rack. <laughs> sure. <laughs> <about> sure. <that? laughs> yeah. sure. Hey, we want to mention uh, level two billiards in uh, Summ Summerdale, New Jersey. Uh, mm -hmm. Owner Joel was here on premises. I think he's still here. Him yeah, he's definitely definitely around, and he's uh he's doing a lot of good stuff too with Cyborg, you know, you on go. tips. That was just a lead in for Jared. He's yep. the spokesman for uh, Cyborg tips. One of the, I mean, one of the best tips out there, honestly. I'm Is a, it really? Yeah, for and I'm still, I'm still. In you your know, personal uh, opinion. In my right. personal opinion, yeah. uh, just one of the most, as of right now, one of the most consistent ones. Wow. Right. Holds chalk amazingly well, and just the, the the layered tips that they have is just phenomenal. Really are. You know, there's so many tips out there. I remember just, you know, 
the one yeah, tip. Yeah, yeah sure. the one tip. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's right. And that was it. And if a mushroom, you, you cut yeah. it. You, you trimmed it. it. That's yeah. right. Yeah. Or whatever, That's yeah. right. People have no idea the troubles, you know. Now the composite of the ball, the cushions are oh, coming yeah. from England, and this, you know. The cushion's all coming all from England. Germany, right? Oh, Germany. Yeah. Okay. Germany, the rubber. I, uh, I was about to say uh, that, you know, I play with one of the best tips out there. Just, add, you know, triangle. I mean, I've been playing that with triangle. Tip, yeah. You know, mm-hmm. after, after I graduated from Le Pro, I went to triangle yep. and never looked back. I've tried every tip out there. They're all great. They're all great. But right. like well, we're you, talking Al. about tips, and guess who's standing behind us? Kamui. Uh, <laughs> how about that? <laughs> 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 we the gotta tips. definitely give All a big shout out to Kamui. Oh, yeah. <laughs> John Batone and company. <laughs> I'm just like one of these OCD guys. I wouldn't know what to do with myself if I if I weren't trimming a tip. You know? Right, 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 right. right. Especially the ones that are made today. You sure. Know? And oh, I, yeah. Yeah. I don't like the triangles. Triangles well, are you easy know, to, to get down. To be fair, you're always going to have to trim a tip. I mean, it's made out of, you know, it's leather. leather. It's going to, you right. know, change. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So there, there's right. maintenance, you know, that you're going to have to take. So. Did that ball miss? Oh, he oh, did miss, but it decided close. to drop. Yeah, with the pocket speed, it dropped. I noticed the <laughs> Is that eight, what it was, pocket noticed speed? noticed the 8, 5, 9, and 10, uh, sort of like yeah. a drill right here. It's just like before you get there, you got to get past this. Mm-hmm. What, what I would like is if uh, one of these tip companies, uh, you know, Gave me a tip that actually worked as well as a triangle. I'd love that. Yeah. <laughs> so the Kick the crazy somebody's got to switch me. Somebody's got to do something to switch. Crazy me. glue out some rubber bands and you're in gear. Yes. You know, full punch. I like it. You know, now now you say that, Alan. People have no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because yeah, <laughs> what, what I'm that old. What are you doing old. with the rubber bands? Yeah, yeah. Don't you put it in a lathe? <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. You know. <laughs> it's the skills. It's the soft skills. Back and forth. Yep. One, two rails. Came right underneath it. Perfect. Yep. Lovely. Yep. That's very good. Oh, that's definitely useful. Very, very good. Yeah. Yep. I mean, if he had rolled forward six inches, he doesn't have that anymore. He'd have to stun it to the side, but he mm-hmm. looks like he's perfect. Yep. This is a roll forward here. Right between the eight and nine. Oh, oh my it. goodness. I oh my! Missed the five altogether. Yeah, yeah he <coughs> was so looking at that eight ball, yeah. he completely forgot. Well, that he also popped up on the shot too. You could tell he was. Uh, yeah, yeah, he did jump up a little bit on yeah. that. I noticed yeah. that. Yeah, but you know what, guys? I think you'd agree with me. Jumping up is is usually the uh, the after, not the before. <laughs> we all jump when we know we've missed the shot. Yeah. Very rare mm-hmm. do you actually, you know. Okay. Sure. 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 Now, interesting, you know, we just talked about the, uh, just talking, kind of goofing around about the tips. And I would like to know, because I've, I've, I'm a type of guy that's used these single layers forever. And, uh, mm-hmm. you know, we've got we've got an opportunity to ask uh, the Kamui here, John Bertone, on what exactly, uh, what we should be looking at here. <laughs> oh, J- John's actually oh, not oh, here oh, right sorry. now. Uh, <laughs> I thought he was behind me. <laughs> uh, my name's Gail Gearhart. Gail, I, sorry about that. I actually... Uh, help out with Kamui. I'm a tip installer and mm-hmm. have uh, really, you know, come on with Kamui uh, due to their consistency. Um, you know, really brought me in. The The brand itself just really speaks for itself in, uh, in you know, the consistent nature and quality product that they put out mm-hmm. uh, brought me on to them. Uh, that That's the biggest thing is, you know, now they, they're actually the only place out there that actually offer you know, there's so many tip counterfeiters out there now. Right. You know, That's right. And, and now, you know, just recently we've come up with our, our tips actually have a serial number on, on each one mm-hmm. that the installer can give to the customer and they can go on to the website and actually know that they have an authentic tip. Right. Which is, uh, you know, which is huge here. Right. Um, so, uh, you know, it's a, it's a big step forward, I think, in the industry. And, I th- you know, it's, it's, you know, just like, the company itself to be trying to lead the way mm-hmm. into the into the next thing. So we're well, real excited about that. Well, it, since we're in between racks here, it is five to five. What kind of leathers do we use there? Because it, traditionally in the past, water buffalo was the the leather of choice for the the uh, old school uh, materials for the leather tip companies. What, what do you guys? Uh, what does the company use? Uh, they they actually I'm fairly certain when you get into the technical aspects I am a tip installer that that does help out here um, I'm fairly certain though that it is uh, pig leather mm-hmm. uh, that they use that's a layered tip um, 
you know, they have the original browns and then the blacks, which are a little more elastic to give a little more English to players would, you know, you know, have a little more trouble, you know, getting the English with a, with a standard tip. So it kind of helps them out. Mm -hmm. sure. Meanwhile, uh, back of the table here, Donnie Mills just broke. And it, did he come up dry again? Yeah, that's looks like uh, he did. Uh, shocking, yep. shocking. He made so many balls the first couple of breaks, and I don't think it's a case where it's raining and more people have walked into the arena. Maybe they did, and maybe they've changed uh, the conditions there, but I'm shocked that uh, he hasn't uh, made more balls in the breaks since the first two right. breaks. Now, this is a B-side matchup, right? This is a B-side matchup? Uh, we're not really sure. We can answer that question in the morning, sir. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> but on the other side, you know, since we do have Kamui, I mean, well, let's be fair. we got to give everybody props. Sure. You know, we're getting into the chalk. You're getting into the Kamui uh, tips. You're getting into check you out. Everybody's, you know, in the industry picking up and picking up. What other products do you have? Um, we actually just came out with a pretty cool product, the, the Diamond Slicer. Hmm. It actually, you know, allows you have all these kicking and banking systems out there that use the math. And it, you can actually put it on a nine-foot table, and it, you know, it breaks it down to tenths of a diamond. So, you know, for, so that people can actually do the math a little easier. People that can't visualize it themselves, it gives them a good practice tool to be able to, you know. So it's sort of use. like a decal that goes mm -hmm. along the rails, Absolutely. and it can be removed and put back on. Yes. Or is it, or is it one-time use? Oh, you uh, could remove it you, and put it back you, on. You can remove it and put it back on. It's, it's a, you know, it's a little. You have to be careful with it, of course, with right. it being the decal. But it's mainly for you know practice and stuff, so that you know people can can be able to visualize themselves down the road, you know, to be able to see that. Right now, I'm going to ask the hardest question, and you're probably not going to be Great able to answer. Shot. It. Great what shot. What booth number are you in <laughs> here at Super Billies Expo? We actually have four booths here. Give I'd us one number. 164, I believe, is one of them. <laughs> okay, so, I'm, I'm, so go, go to booth 164 out there, and if they're not there, there just, just keep on shouting and say, come away, come away. Big it, shout out it, to Kamui. It's real simple, though. Look for the big cue, for big floating cue ball. That's you right. will find us. There That's right, the big right. floating cue ball. Thank you, thank Gail, you, for Gail. sitting in, and thank you for Absolutely. giving us that. Thank you. And thank you. Uh, two, actually, Kamui-sponsored players here shooting, so it's yeah. actually a good timing for all. Excellent. That's right. Thank you very much, Al, for having me. So I would like to say that you know one of these days, uh, one of these tip manufacturers will get together with the uh, the high tech uh, adhesive companies out there to provide us a PSA pr pressure sensitive adhesive on the tip. You just peel the sticker off, plop it on there, push it, and that's it. Now you well, heard it here first. Yeah. If it comes up, I want to make sure my name is on the patent. In fact, I'm going to go <laughs> patent it right now. That's not peel a bad and idea. stick PSA <coughs> permanent uh, pseudo permanent uh, tip. So Get it, get it in the Modell Sporting Goods stores. Or yeah, there you uh, go. There like you that. go. Yeah, you're done. Yeah. Not a bad idea. I like it. Torsten Holman up at the table here. A little bit of a thin cut on the three ball. Uh, looks like it's one of those standard ten ball racks mm. where you have nothing to go in the middle Overcut of the table. It. Overcut yeah. it. Overcut it. We've got to have some misses here on, on this table. Mm -hmm. Maybe they've got the jitters because they are on the Upstate Owl stream. What do you well, think? Nah, <laughs> they, these guys here have no fear gear on. It's a new gear that's out. Mm -hmm. You know what? No fear gear. I yeah, like there's it. There's been too many innings right here transferred. I think so. Mm -hmm. I think so. Well, the break has been funny with uh, with eight Donnie ball. Mills. You got to hit that eight ball. Yeah, oh, he did. He got the tickle. He got the love tickle. Really, yeah. the love tickle. Yeah, He's going to wind up in a bad position. The love position. bump. <laughs> straight on the four ball. Very straight. Is one of those where do they just a stop shot and play the five in the opposite corner? I think so. I think so. And that tells me the way Donnie had to walk around there. He sort of had to laugh. Yeah. Right. Again, he probably thought the same thing. Yeah. Well, I got really fortunate yep. with that yep. bump. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And once again, we're going to have Vivian in the booth uh, sometime during this evening. We just, want to mention, we just want to mention uh, the Tornado Open. It's a hundred thousand dollars there. It's going to take place at, in Hollywood, Florida. Hmm. Where where is this exactly? Hollywood, this Florida. Yeah, but what casino is this and resort? That I don't see. Yeah, right there. somewhere down there. Really? <laughs> oh, it's at the Hard Rock. I'm sorry. Oh, You're right, Freddie. Down there, somewhere it down there. It's at the Hard Rock. <laughs> Hollywood, Florida. That's uh, down in the southwest of Florida. Is that down near Tampa? Water? 
No, no. That, no, okay. No, no. That's in the, it's near the Fort Lauderdale area. Oh, okay, gotcha. That, that area. And that's another Moscone point ranked tournament, by the oh. way. Oh, that one is? Oh, yeah. that's great. That's yeah. Great. Uh, Very good. I'll be in Hollywood, Florida next week. Visit my good friend oh. Teddy Harris, Q maker extraordinaire. He's here. Yes, he is. Yeah. Teddy's been away from the Super Billiards Expo for a while. He used to be the only game in town as far as Q Mechanics going out. Everybody's right. out there. I remember and I him think with <laughs> the little trailer for years, right? For years, yeah. He was the busiest man in the world here f for uh, quite some time. The gangsters got some really funny stories. In fact, it's on YouTube where Rob Size is in the backseat. Ginky, they, they were all young in the backseat, and they are reminiscing about being on the road with Teddy Harris. <laughs> Teddy Harris used to have a... Trailer. A, a little trailer, uh, and they had to get out and push the trailer <laughs> up sure. the hill with the car because the car couldn't push the track, pull the trailer. <laughs> you got to see it's on YouTube. I, <laughs> I found it hilarious. I used to hang out with the gangsta wow. for a long time. Oh, that's very interesting funny. what he did there. That's a very tricky shot, and he, got, he landed wow. great on it, actually. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be afraid of scratching the side doing that, <laughs> but he... He's, he's got to spin below the 10 here. Well, if yeah. he's straight, he sort yeah, of just draw it straight gets back. Straight back. Yeah. Gets yeah. a little straight bit back of spin. Little bit. Beautiful. A little bit of the inside English and come off that rail and get closer to the nine ball. I think so. Uh, and just gonna left. A little left. A little high left, yeah. And then come up two rails, play ten ball in the corner. Well, oh, or just and come up just one fall, rail, yep. Fall. All depends on how he's feeling. He must be feeling pretty good right now to go up <laughs> one rack against Torsten Holman. Six to five. Donnie Mills up 6-5, Tor Torsten Holman to break. Torsten's gone back and forth here, left and right and left and right. He's back to the right side, but he's been hitting them better the last few few breaks. Got to keep the cue ball in the center of the table. He's been losing it to the right side here. Mm -hmm. And lost they it to the right again, but the yeah. and made raise. a ball. He's going to be straight on the one. I mean, <laughs> yeah. Unbelievable. He's not hitting as square as he'd like, but he's at least making a ball, and, yeah, and it's he's not getting like shape on the one. It's not like he's cut breaking it or anything like no, that. No, yeah. ball must have went in the drink. Right. And, of course, he got straight on the one. How many times has that happened where you don't hit the ball? Oh, <laughs> great. The cue ball is perfect for the one. For me, it's like I can hit the balls perfectly or not perfectly. I never see the one. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know? I suppose that's what the uh, push rule is for. <laughs> yeah, I get it. <laughs> push rule is made for people like me. <laughs> I tell you, getting good on the four. This is this is the this is the main shot right here. Yeah, getting good on the four to get to the five. Yeah, yeah. I, it looks like it's all he's got to do. <coughs> I say all he has to do is get some kind of angle because mm -hmm. there's two ways to get there. Right. As long as he get has an angle, this one is a draw one rail that mm -hmm. squeezes yeah. it right between the five and six. Nice little field goal position there. Right. You know, this is one of those uh, one of those shots uh, in rotation that comes up all the time. Mm -hmm. You use low right hand English. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a bread and butter shot for all rotation games and. It's important for people to understand that this yep. is why you use English. As it long makes as makes that yeah. so easy. And he hit it perfect, yeah. too. Yeah. He's on he the did. correct side of the five. He's, yeah. he's yeah. in great shape here. Right. Just roll it to that long rail and come off. Yeah, that's, a, that's great, uh, Freddie, to bring that up forward. You know, uh, huh? for a lot of amateurs out there, because we do have some amateurs out there. Sure. We've got to keep that in mind. And little, that, little that stop shot, shot here. required more <coughs> of English than speed. That's exactly, right. yeah. you know, exactly. Let the spin do the work. Right. right. It, it English in that case makes that shot easier. The path, the the, the pattern that you're going to have the cue ball. Meanwhile, you know, so sometimes in the booth here we take it for granted that everybody's watching. Right, it's you know, yeah. happens to be a seasoned player, yeah, right. Or, right, or at least a you know a DC that actually has, you know, knows what we're talking about. There, there are right. people yeah. watching out there that mm -hmm. never played pool before. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's going to swing Look this. this. Swing at three. Yeah, I just bounce out and swing play in the side. Oh, play yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Th that's the that's the kiss shot. 
I'm K I S S. I'm scared of these side yeah. pockets. I'll tell you, I'm scared of them. Uh, I agree with now. you, Al. I mean, so many. There it is. I'm, so I'm, many, I'm the yeah. opposite. I'm the S S I K person. So simple. <laughs> so simple. <laughs> but you know, the, these side pockets can be deadly. But <laughs> yeah. Torsen shoots so straight, and yeah. I mean, you know. Yeah. Tie ball game. Break and run. Torsten Holman. Route six 66. Six. Yep. Route 66. Need to get a score update on uh, the pain versus get some. Mike uh, DeShane yeah. yep. against Sean Wilkie. I'll get an update yep. on that. Thank you. With that check, yeah, with me? I'm the new runner. <laughs> ah, yes. <laughs> Donnie Mills has to get something going on his break. Mm -hmm. Just inspecting his own rack. You talk about Donnie Mills being a rack mechanic. <laughs> Just make sure his own rack is. Just want to make sure it's clear that it's I didn't good. call him a rack mechanic. I said he paid attention to the rack. I'm sorry. <laughs> yes. Yeah. All right. I don't want to. I don't want to trademark anything with him. So <laughs> rack technician. Rack there, there you go. Yes. <laughs> well. The main player, Mike Deshane, is up five four on get some Sean Wilkie. Wilkie to break on the, the other tables. You know, I think this. Uh, I think this is actually a B side match because I think Earl beat Thorsten yesterday. Yeah, this is a this is a B side. And I match. thought so. Yeah. Yep. yeah. He let he let uh, less power on that break, mm -hmm. and look, the yeah. two ball went right in the side. Yeah, Dead straight in the one. I think if the, if it I passed the nine, but yeah. But that's the speed he did in the first couple of breaks, and it's you know it's wide open. Uh, well I say what's wide open. The five six is not yeah. wide open. The one nine is not wide open. But yeah. What I really mean is that they went. Far apart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> the break was uh -huh. one, right. Definitely some work to do here. Yeah, sure. Right. Yeah. I mean, that either plays straight in or maybe even plays the carom 1 9. Carom. I mean, depends if he can see that straight or not. Looks like he's eyeing up that uh, carom. I think so because he yeah. never he's, hasn't looked at the other ball. No, no he's right. playing that, safe play behind safe. the 9. Yeah, that works too. That wasn't so uh, bad. That really doesn't work. You know, anytime you leave that object ball yeah. in rotation, it's <coughs> like that. Know, yeah, yeah, near a pocket. Thorsten's going to probably go long banking this cue ball. Yeah. No, oh, this is no, cool no, no, no. He's, he's playing a kick and coming safety. back behind the nine, too. That's, I like that. Man, well, this is a kick touch, save. This is kick a touchy save. shot here. Cue ball should be frozen to the nine after this. Yeah. Yeah. This is long. such a touchy shot. Yeah. All he has to do is, uh, right he's looking at here to make sure they hit it the right side yeah. of the center of one, mm -hmm. the, the one ball as he approaches it. That means he's got a yeah. couple. Cu but once he hits, this is a hanger shot. I'm going to say this and be like, goof it all up. Yeah, wow. It's that's absolutely a hanger nice. shot. As long as he made sure the cue ball coming off the cushion was going to hit the right side of the mm -hmm. one, uh, right. this right side of the center of the one, not the left side of the center of the one, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the one ball, would, the cue ball would automatically just leak towards the nine. Right. I tell you what, I can't thank these guys enough, Freddie. Can't thank you enough. The jazz man coming all the way from <laughs> Virginia. I can't thank you enough. And Steve, come and get some. Yeah, from, 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 New, from New Hampshire. So New Hampshire. I, got, I got a hike too. Right. <laughs> all over the place. Coming from New Hampshire, you're used to hiking. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah. What do you do here? This You don't have to call the 10 ball. He can, no, yeah. Does he take a swipe at it? 66. Uh, I doubt uh, it. No, I doubt no, it. Not no, at this time. So. Playing the, play the billiard. <coughs> the carom the 110, yeah. I mean. Because it's a two way shot. It's a given. The one ball's coming up by the nine. Yeah. It's That's not like true. you're giving anything away. That's true. Did the one go by the 10? Or I you might have it. to cut that one a little thinner than that, though. If, if, the, one, yeah. if the one passes, he's shooting the one. If oh, it absolutely. Does, uh, yeah. If it doesn't pass, uh, if you shoot your shot, uh, Al, the one ball comes. Get out of the way, Austin. <laughs> I don't know it. Oh, it yeah. does. It looks Does like it, it go goes. in the corner? It looks like it goes. Barely, but it looks like it goes. I like the carom. No, he's doing yeah, he's uh, just playing I think he safe all the way. Yeah, you know safe. why? Yeah, he he yeah. If he would have played the carom, the, he had to overcut that one ball, and he would have exactly. left it down, down, down that yeah. side yeah, of the table. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, 
So yeah, that's definitely the right shot. Yep. Did you eat? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, guys. I'm talking to my son in the back. <laughs> <laughs> we'll give you a pass. Thank you. <laughs> Don't whack me. S <laughs> safety back here. This is the end-to-end -end type the of safety. Well, a cue ball at the end rail, one ball at the end rail. If you could actually get behind the nine beat, that'd be a damn good shot. Oh, he's tucking oh, behind the nine. Yeah, wow. Behind the nine. Beautiful wow, shot. Wow, that is a nice shot. Beautiful shot. <coughs> That is a great shot. Which makes her a very hard kick too. I mean, I think the four balls in the way, the nine balls in the way, the long rail. I mean, he's got a tough kick here. Mm -hmm. Well, if we have an angle here. I can't uh, tell if he can. It's tough to see. Oh, that. maybe you can see yeah. in front of the yeah, four and go one in, rail. He's going to spin, spin into it. Yeah. yeah. Get to the top of the one. Oh, he hit, he hit oh the bottom. Yeah. Oh, he yeah. hit that one. Hey, look, where's the he's cue ball going? He's going? He's going in the well, drink. We know where yeah. it's yeah. going. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. He knows where it's going. Yeah. How come the one didn't go in? How come <laughs> the cue went in? <laughs> <laughs> explain it's that to me. It's one of those. It's yeah. one of those. No, explain that to it me. It never yeah. fails. It the cue always finds the heart of the pocket. Right. Yeah. It's the magnet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it does. Absolutely. And unfortunate the break there for for Toasty. Donnie says, "Thank you very much. I'll take it over now." Yeah, it was an unfortunate break. Donnie Mills played a pretty good. Pretty good safety. That was a great so safety. Yeah. From Wonderful. where he was to get behind that nine was pretty fantastic. Yeah, yeah I think he's just looking. He's just looking there to see if the five, five passes. plays past the. It goes. Yeah, it, it, it. Oh, you yeah, can't do that. No. Now, see, can, that you, now you can, can you do see, that? that? That's a foul. No, right that's there. supposed to be a foul, and uh, a referee, if he was in, would have wow. called him on that. Wow. You that's interesting. The I'm world, the world standardized rule says you cannot use a cue ball like that to measure a ball, an area as Can a it? measurement tool. Hmm. I'm kind of shocked that uh, Toasty didn't say anything. Yeah, I mean, but, but you know, I maybe for this tournament they allow doing that. I don't know. I, I, don't know. I know they changed some go. rules, so but I have no idea on that one. I've never heard of anybody <laughs> saying that's that that was uh, okay, no matter what it was. Right? Yeah, that's tr yeah. Yeah, it's uh, you know that's uh, well, that was that was a bit uh, cheeky. Let's yeah. just say. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it was it's a little it cheeky. It's yeah. happened, <coughs> and uh, off we go. Yeah, and this. There you go. Beautiful yep. shot. Wow, that's pretty blatant, too. Well, we'll be yeah. talking about that on the Internet because we called it like that. The commentators <laughs> were saying. <laughs> <laughs> Did you mute me? Yeah, I was <laughs> top secret stuff in the background. Uh, All right, Donnie. Three balls, everything just about hanging. So yep. should be no problem getting out yep. here. It's yep. 66 right now. Donnie Mills looking to pull up one game yep. here. I tell you what, this has been a seesaw match. It has. it has been. It has been. You got two great players of this caliber. Yep. Yeah, that's straight down the table. That's the way I like to play yeah. this one from that angle. Yep. Just like there that. You go. If he had had a slightly uh, shallower angle, like well, two rails. Another one of those kiss shots. I always like to yeah. say. That's right. <laughs> so simple, I know. Yep. Yeah. Just, just on that note, you know, I mean, take a look at the physical shape of both of these guys. Oh, oh yeah. 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 That's right. Donnie Mills, seven to six. Now, how They're tall? I have to ask. How tall is Donnie Mills? Like, he looks like he's, he's like eight, eight foot two. He's eight feet. I think <laughs> he's about eight, six, eight, three, eight, eleven. I, I believe. No, it's, you're, eight, you're right, three, Al. It's it's, it's in that really? it's in that range. Yeah. Torsten is not as tall. He's not all that tall. He yeah, seems yeah. tall because of of his of his build, but he's not right. all that tall. Yeah. Um, but Donnie Mills, yeah, he's around six two, six three, I think. You know, yeah. in the booth, we're supposed to know all those questions. It, we should. We should know what kind of cue he's using. Why the cue looks so long. Um, <laughs> what kind of tip they're using? We should know. You know, you know. You should know where his um, girlfriend or wife went to school. Mm -hmm. That's right. There you go. Now I'm going to hook you up with one of those on tips. I'm telling you. Okay. Two cyborgs. Right, excellent. Now we'll, we'll know. I was playing with another brand oh, that, uh, that we were discussing. He'll be a happy camper if you get him a triangle. Yes. Oh, <laughs> the triangle. There you go. And the Everything ball. moved around. Yeah. And the cue ball is the one that found its way it's like amazing. it had eyes. You know, it's that magnet that. thing going on. He it's actually amazing. broke that one, and it went to the left side instead of the right, but it still, still found, found that found right, side right side pocket. pocket <laughs> right? Look at that. Unreal. Yeah. Explain that to me. Uh, you, you can't. <laughs> this is unreal. Pool is a funny game like that. Yep. You know. How do you explain that to me, Freddie? You know, <laughs> there is no explanation. <laughs> no, there is an explanation. <laughs> we need a mathematician. We need the mathematician to come out here and, you know, it's that uh, SH rule. 
Well, you know, I could go. Happens. Get, <laughs> yeah, you're right. It I could go get my buddy. I could go get my buddy Earl right now. You know, and he could he could probably tell you. <laughs> in this is an hour. It's the reason why we don't have side pockets in, in the future yeah. of this game. Speaking of that, that's going to be one heck of a match. I am interested. I am interested to watch that match. That would be a heck of a match. Well, it's taking place. It's taking yeah. place. In one crazy statement, Earl said there should be no side pockets in uh, in pool. Yeah. And uh, yeah, Greg Greg Sullivan said, "Let's do it. <laughs> yep. Let there be no side Let pockets." Let there be no side <laughs> pockets. So we're going to see exactly what happens. Earl Strickland and Darren Appleton. Yeah. I believe it's happening very soon, is it not? Or I don't know exactly the date on May that. May sixth, seventh, and eighth, up in Akron, Ohio. Yeah. I will be there two days prior. Okay. Oh, there you go. Come on by and say hello. Interesting shot here because uh, Donnie Mills played for this side of the four ball. The five must pass the ten ball. I, uh, he would never have played there if it didn't pass the ten ball. Yeah. Right. That makes sense. Yep. Yep. Two rails and up for the five. And by the same type of idea, the six ball must six pass ball the seven. seven ball. Yep. Right. From I our mean, it angle, it'll it definitely like it'll it does, definitely pass with speed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know, absolutely. Yeah. Sure. Well, look who's uh, look who's showed up, Mr. Uh, Tony <laughs> Robles, who's uh, hey. going to join us in just a second here. Let me activate your mic. Oh, excellent, Tony Robles, the silent assassin. Hey, Como how's it going, guys? Good. good. How you doing, Tony? All right, good, good. Thank you for having me. Hey, Tony, welcome aboard, sir. All right, it's always yeah. a pleasure seeing to see you guys. Uh, Tony, we're at the Super Billiards Expo. You know, mm -hmm. as much as we can, we're trying to get everybody in from different booths. We don't mind promoting everybody. We want to know what you're doing with the Predator Pro-Am Tour. <laughs> Give us your next stops, your biggest events, whatever you want to do. Feed us. Only, only out, right? Right. Only feed us in. That's right. We love you, brother. You know that. <laughs> I didn't come here for that purpose. But I know you if didn't. You you're insist. Here now. You're here now. <laughs> I do insist. No, I mean, I mean, I mean. You know, you cover a lot of our major tournaments, and yes. you're going to be covering the Ginky Memorial very soon. And um, yeah. that one last year. It's been growing every year, and we've always limited 120 players, and last year we had to open the field because it sold out quicker than ever before, and we had 240 players last year. That's wow. amazing. It's like, uh, honestly, it was so much work to organize because we do the draw ahead of time, and we have to take the entries ahead of time that when I played in the pro event, my I don't remember who I played, but I was playing one of the pros, and he woke me up twice. Yeah, I remember match. that. I fell asleep twice. Yeah, goodness yeah, gracious, yeah. <laughs> I was exhausted, man. It was exhausting. Everybody does get exhausted, but everybody yeah. had a great time. I'll tell you. You know, it's a lot of work, like you said, and you get kind of knocked out. Your your next uh, tournament, when is it? Um, the next tournament is next weekend. It's Steinway Billiards. Yeah, it's going to be stop number seven. It's already seven. Will you believe seven. we're in April? It's it was just the other day that we just celebrated the new year. Yeah. I right. just turned 50 on April 1st. You oh, by, by the way, You're happy kidding. birthday, T. Yeah. Happy birthday. Happy thank belated. You. Yeah, thank you. It's unbelievable. Um, I uh, People come to me all the time say, you know, you don't look 50. And I say, listen, if you get the don't look, just for don't men, believe them. Don't believe real them. black. Hey, right? just for men, hey, real black. There you go. Hey, <laughs> hey who are you talking to? Yeah, there you go. I'm only a year younger than yeah, you, you, so you, 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 you'll do fine. You'll do fine. You know? I uh, I turn 50 next year, uh, oh, Tony, wow. and uh, my secret is um, I wear hats. <laughs> oh, gotcha. I hear you, man. I hear you, Fred. Yeah. But you know, I actually wasn't going to come to the expo uh, this year at all because I have so much work, and I had told everyone that I wasn't going to come, and then. Predator uh, uh, gave me a call and they said, "Nope, unacceptable. We're about to unveil that new Revo shaft." I love right. that shaft. God, and they, they just great. they just got me a car. You know, took care of everything wow. and I nice. drove here. So you know, I thank him for that. But that I, I will not play with with a wood shaft anymore after I'm playing with that shaft. Oh, really? That's I, how much I I love it. I was absolutely astonished, absolutely yeah. astonished how real it felt. Yeah. How real? I yeah. mean, just the the feedback was fantastic. Uh, it, it felt just like wood. It reacted just like wood, except, like you said, you know, you can aim straight, absolutely straight, and put a lot of spin on the ball. It adds more spin. Yeah. Phenomenal. I'm, I'm, I'm definitely. Uh, you must be talking about the Revo, right? Oh, absolutely, yeah. absolutely. That was the first thing I did when I got here. I said, "Where's the Revo?" That's, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that scores good. So eight JT. to six. Eight to six. Yeah. Donnie Mills just broke dry again. So you got the uh, next week. I'm sorry. Sorry, Freddie. That's yeah. right. Next weekend, Tony, right? Yeah, next weekend we're going to be at Steinway Billiards. And, yeah, Memorial and then we're going to have Memorial coming up. We're going to have the Gangster. So, you know, we, we've taken entries. I actually took some entries this tournament. And we'd like oh, to great. mention that it is uh, Moscone Point ranked. That is correct. That is correct. That's fantastic. We have uh, four of our stops this year of Moscone Cup Points events. So, uh, you know, i got to give a, a special thank you to Luke Riches from Matchroom Sports. Uh, fortunately okay. for me, I've been able to maintain a uh, – 
a great relationship with them after playing in the Moscone Cup in 2003 and 2004. I got to know them a bit better and uh, very good people. Very yeah. good people. Yes, I really are. respect what they do for the sport. I mean, they're extremely hardworking people. Yeah. And yep. they get, they get well, it Well, wait a minute. Don't be so modest here, Val. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? 24 hours, seven days a week, this guy's on well, the clock. Talk about modest. What do you think of Upstate Al? Oh, I yeah. always put him on the Without spot every <laughs> single <laughs> time. Right? I mean, I the mean, jazz man. You, two, yeah. you two guys, I, I don't know how you do it. I really right. don't. I mean, like, for instance, I remember you were saying that it was, uh, it was recently where you had uh, one tournament where y you were so busy, you know, being the tournament director, you had to forfeit a match of your own. Yeah. You know, yeah, just to just true. run the run the tournament. That's dedication right there. Well, you had to watch that's, a player at that amazing. time. I do remember yeah. that. But you yeah. want to, you know, something. I say it over and over again. It's a team effort. It, yeah. You know, you guys here sitting in the booth, everybody out there selling their products, all the tours going on. It's it's all a team effort. You can, you know you can't just point and say hey you know you're doing you could say you're doing a good job yeah. but you know what I wouldn't be doing this kind of job if it wasn't for you guys and the players and vice outside. versa yeah right you know what well, I mean I so, agree so uh, I do appreciate it but uh, you're a hardworking man sir it, but see that's the thing it doesn't feel like hard work <laughs> because right. I'm enjoying you're it enjoying you're enjoying it, it, right? your passion really, too yeah. Yeah. yeah you you must be you must have just drank a check yo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Or had too, ma too much Wheaties. This Meanwhile, <laughs> back at the ranch, back at the ranch, Torsten lines up on the seven here to eyeball yep. it. Torsten yeah, I don't know seven. if it goes. I, I don't know if it, I think he was trying to play in the side. It seemed like he wanted to, but um, he's got to shoot it now. He's, he's not shaking his head. He can, he can eyeball something or a half pocket or something like that. But you know, yeah. he can just do, I mean, if it goes by, which it looks like it does, he can just do a little small soft draw and still play the uh, eight and same pocket draw back or go around. I mean, he looks, he's, he's, he's not in too bad a shape. Uh, mm -hmm. The way he's looking, he's going to, yeah. it looks like he's following to play the eight ball it in the side It looks like he's going to hit it with low right in the side pocket. Yep. Either low right or low left. Depends on how much speed he wants. I don't think he needs inside English here if he does shoot in the side. Yep. It's tight quarter, so now, now he's going back to the corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's to me, that's yeah. that's. I think that's, that's the shot. Yeah, that's it is a shot. shot. I just want to make sure he doesn't have to shoot over the tent. Nice and soft. Right. There it is. Just, just like that. Nice yeah. shot. Yep. And you just take what. Take what the table has here. That's yeah. right. And notice what he did, too. He hit it with enough speed to make sure that he doesn't have to shoot right. over the 10. Right. Yeah. That's a big mistake a lot of players make when they're learning the game. A little zigzag shot here. Yep. Back and forth. Yep. Center right. of the pocket. Speed, speed, Boom. speed. A little harder. Speed. Oh. Yeah. Well, he can yeah. get there. Yeah. Right. I like where he left it. You know, it's yeah, two more inches, it would have been bad. Yeah. And, you know. He's probably a hair shorter than he wanted to be, I yeah. would think. But, he, other than that, but he's good. He can still make this and get out. What yep, a nice, nice touch shot. that was. That's a nice great touch. Shot. Yep. Nicely done. So now this makes it 8 7, right? It yep. will indeed. Eight, seven. It will. Right now, yep. Seven. seven serving eight coming up. Oh, you got Vivian there playing against uh, Jennifer Beretta. Yep. yep. In the background. I see Vivian today. She stops by. She said, Tony, 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 you going to play my tournament this year? Yeah. You know, Are you going to do it? You yeah. should, right? Oh, yeah. Can you do it? I'll, I'll do anything for her. Because That's she looked wonderful. out for me one time, and I never forgot that. You know? That's yeah. wonderful. That's wonderful. Yeah, both uh, you know, both you and her are doing great things for the sport, yeah. without a doubt. Mm -hmm. Well, the fact that she landed her tournament in the Hollywood Hotel Casino. That's right. amazing. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, that's huge. That's where they used to have the uh, Steve Bizrak Championships. That's right. Uh -huh. Seminole Tribe of Florida. It's a beautiful venue. Yep. Yeah, who knows? Maybe I'll show up with my wife and we'll play Scotch Doubles. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> How is Gail doing anyway? Do we she's doing fantastic. Um, she's very sorry that she can't make it, but she wanted to make sure that I told everyone uh, said hi for her. Oh, mm -hmm. wonderful. Because, Big you know, as you know, she's a CPA and that's it's right. crunch time, so the deadline is tomorrow midnight. Oh, that's right. So oh, that's right. So she's been working 12, 13-hour days. That's wow, amazing. That's but the beautiful thing about it is that she, she has her own client. She works from home. Oh, that's so wonderful. So she's that happy is. to do it because, yeah. you know, she that opens the back door. The weather's beautiful. She looks <laughs> at the yep. tree. She right. hears the birds chirping. You know, <laughs> that's it's pretty great. awesome. Yep, that's awesome. Yeah, anytime you get a chance to work from home, that's a, it's a wonderful thing. My wife, you know, she does. Uh, she has a couple of businesses that she works from home, and uh, it's it's a it's a good thing. It's a really good thing. Yeah. I work out of the house. Uh, sometimes it, it gets kind of confusing whether or not I'm supposed to be getting up, brushing my <laughs> teeth, uh, yeah, going yeah. outside. <laughs> you know. I have no idea what I'm supposed to so, do. So that's your wife there? Yes, that's Connie. Hey, so it's always good to see the boss. Just one of the yes, <laughs> oh, and trust me, she yeah. is the boss. <laughs> right. There's no doubt. Good to see you, Connie. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, Torsten has to 
had to leave himself a tough shot on the two, and the three balls at the side pocket, yeah. so it looks like he just has to make it. This isn't exactly a wide open table. No, it's no. not. The and the three to the four is going to be uh, quite tricky. Right. No yeah, this is one of those shots where you just have to really focus on just making the ball. You know, yeah. wherever the cue ball lands, worst case scenario, you can play a safe. Oh, uh, nice. There you go. No you called it. Making the ball, yep. yeah. You called it. Yeah. Did everything right except for uh, pocketing it, unfortunately. Yeah. He almost got away with it. Yep. I, I, I'm trying to figure out if he can, I mean, assuming I he's going for the shot, if he can hit it thin I enough yeah. to go four rails for the three. I think cut this right in the corner and come, like you said, One, almost two, where he is three. right now to get shape on the three. Mm -hmm. I, you know, he may he just play. He may just play safe and spin the ball back up behind that. Yeah, those that three too. blockers. I mean, at this point, I don't know if he wants to. You really think he wants to thin that ball in there? Because that he's going to have to let yeah. the cue ball go a little bit. Well, what usually I don't think it's a bad shot because yeah. if he overcuts it, he might leave him safe if he's got right. right two way shot. Yeah. yeah. It usually, when we're sitting up here at the at the booth looking at this, that the shot looks more hor you know, horrendous. But it's it, it probably is not as bad as it looks. You know. Mm -hmm. and yeah, and there it goes. That yeah, was a great good. shot. Oh, but and he ran into the five. He, yeah. he still has a shot. But he still got a shot on it. But now it's interesting because I think the three plays on the side, but it's a position on the four ball. Once he tried to draw it straight out. Oh, and I mean, that's another thing, too. He could play the three yeah. off the eight into the side pocket, draw yeah. off the rail, and come right back up between the four and the five. Or he it's could tricky. just, I think he's he just, just cinch it. I think he's just yeah. cinch, cinch it. Because and then he could shoot the four and the play the five in the, the same four, pocket. Yeah. The four is easy from anywhere on this on the right side here. This, this, the four is not laying bad. Yeah. Wow. He's had a right? slow roll it. And oh, oh he, he played, played safe. 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 Wow. That's a good shot, too. Oh, that was that was great commentary awesome. there because we were all over that shot. <laughs> I mean, we did everything except for the, what he actually was going to do. Except for the same. Well, no, I mean, he probably <laughs> couldn't make it as, 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 as easily as, as we thought. thought, right. thought yeah. you know? sure. So if that's the case, then, I mean, he, he shot the right shot because right. he used a seven as a stopper, so it was like an automatic save. Right. Perfect. Right. Yep. There's no one rail kick across because of the seven ball. Mm -hmm. You can't go between the seven and eight without a mass say, and it looks like up tail uh, to the four ball is, uh, is a choice. Thank you. But he'd be kicking, keeping both balls into the open. Mm -hmm. right. That was a great safe. Good results. Yeah, I don't really see an easy kick here. Yeah. I mean, unless he and tries to go, go. He's going to go with the kick mass. No, he's, no, he's going to intentionally the foul. He's going to tie up the uh, three. Yep. yep. He, he did. He sure did. Yeah. Hmm. We didn't have much there. We no. didn't have much there. It was no. a good shot. He hit it good. The only thing that's scary about this is, I mean, with the I don't know if the three out, I don't know if the three foul rule is in effect, but I mean, you do oh. that, you know, you can possibly put your opponent on two, and yeah. I gotta believe that the three foul rule is in effect. But yeah, I know we've been asking some of these rules. <laughs> yeah, there's been a couple of rule changes in this format, so you know, I gotta tell you, I wouldn't even assume that. Yeah, <laughs> that's this, true. I mean, because <laughs> this this is for ten ball. This is the uh, the most unique rules I've seen yep. in ten ball so far. And he might just. He what might are just the do rules? That. I don't even know what the rules. I didn't it's, play anything. It's basically nine ball yeah. with ten ball. Yeah. Old yeah. ten ball rules. Old ten ball rules. Original ten ball rules, <laughs> I think. Except for the ten doesn't go on the, uh, on the break. So, yeah. so it's nine ball, but rules with ten ball. Yeah, you don't have no, no call pocket. You don't, you don't have to call yeah. the ten. Yeah, it's. Uh, I'm not a fan of those. Neither yeah. am I. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sitting here smiling like I love it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's there's no give backs. That was ten ball does not count. You actually you don't have to call it, and the one, two, and three don't have to be on the corners. Right. Mm-hmm. Oh, gotcha. Like I know in your predator tour, the two and the three have to be in the have corner. That's correct. Not in this case. But I mean, listen. At the same time, you, it's the same for your opponent, no matter sure. what the rules That's are. Right. So you That's just right. got to do the you same know, thing, make the yeah. best of it. If you take advantage of the opportunities enough, then uh, mm -hmm. you won't have to rely so much on uh, losing by someone missing mm -hmm. a ball and you go. behind yeah. the ball. That's true. Thanks, coach. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. you got it, man. Anytime. It's always a pleasure, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> That one's on me. Excellent, excellent. Slow roll of three and Lucas tried to stick it behind the six ball. Is that eight ball? Behind the eight ball. Yeah, he left him a kick shot He did, yeah. He left him a kick. He left him some paint. Yep. What are you going to do? Are you going to fire at this kick? Why not? I don't know. If the three isn't frozen, I might just tap it. Yeah. Yeah. Unless he can hit it two rails and then hit like half of the three and have the cue ball go by the nine, stop it there with the eight. I don't know. That's true. Because I mean, the last thing you, last thing you want to do is just slam into it and then break them wide open for Donnie to just run them out. Yeah. I mean, you got to be careful here. So the problem is that since the three is being stopped by the eight, you know yep. that means if the cue ball hits it dead on, the cue right. ball is going to slow down too, and it's going to stay next to the three. Well, it looks like if he solid. hits it hard, I mean, it looks like the, the eight ball is going to hit the point, and it's just going to come out. I don't think mm -hmm. that's. I think yeah. he's stripping some paint here. 
Oh, you can strip the paint. That's even better. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. You can see a piece of the three. No, he changed his mind. Changed his no, mind. He's yep. going the two. Yeah, like I said, look. You called it, yeah. Right? Yeah. And he, he made the eight. Made the eight. eight. Perfect. Wow. He didn't just almost make the eight. Yeah, yeah he made, <laughs> he the, made eight. the eight. Perfect. He hit it great. He hit he it great. great. Just, I didn't think that the eight was going to go. Yeah. That was a great shot. He's going to come up. have to come up with another great shot. Mm-hmm. Well, he's uh, he's uh, yeah. one of the best I've seen shooting these shots, whether it's on the rail, almost close yeah. to the rail. He shoots, he hits these shots really well. Yeah. I mean, you, well, you shoot the three down in the corner and then just float down for the four in the yeah. other well, corner, or yeah, he's basically looking to you know hit it with a little bit of pace and bouncing two rails somewhere in the um, oh okay. bottom lower, left quadrant. Lower Take left just yeah, quadrant. just yeah, oh, just intercept a longer shot on the be four. It has to be the left side of that quadrant. Yeah, it's far over there. It's yeah, tough because he's you know the ten ball is in play. Yep, beautiful oh, yeah, shot. He hit that great. Yep, uh, he's right there. Going. He got there. Yep, he's there. Yeah. Nice shot. He knew he was going to have to accept the longer shot. Yeah, right, that, you know. See, I thought he could have just slow rolled it and then bent on that long rail and then cut the four. I didn't know he had the angle he had. Good hit on this. Yep. That's okay. That's hit it full out. enough. You yeah. got fortunate there, but that was good enough. Again, cue ball on the rail and fired it right <coughs> in. Yep. Yeah, some people say he got he got rewarded for making a great shot. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That's exactly right. <laughs> yep. Yeah, and he had to shoot it like that, so what kind of chalk is he using? His chalk is all over the table. It, probably it looks like Kamui to me. It's probably just because of the camera lights that we have here. Mm -hmm. But I did see him wiping it off earlier. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it, it might be Kamui. I can you ask him to get out of the That's way Kamui. so we can see? Yeah, he's yeah, using he's Kamui. Yeah. <laughs> Again, low left-hand English. Yeah. There it is. Nice shot. And Look at Vivian on the other table. She's like in dead punch over there. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. That's VV has got one. Yep. Yep. So yeah. it looks like Thorson's Slide tied it up tied again. It up. 88. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. We got Don ourselves a ball game. Back yes. and forth. Indeed. Donnie Mills has had a, a couple game lead twice. Yeah, other than that, I don't think this game has gone past a three game or past a two game lead. They're just coming back and forth, back and forth. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I had this uh, uh, gentleman that I met that uh, started playing in my, my league on Monday nights, and uh, he uh, had me teach his 10-year-old son. You know, uh, he, son loves the game. He wants to, me to, to help mold him into a champion. Mm -hmm. He played today for the first time ever. Uh, he's only 10 years old. And, and he played against a guy that won a big tournament. The kid, I think he's like 11, 12. Mm -hmm. And he lost, and I tried to, you know, comfort him, and he just started crying. I felt oh. so bad for the oh. kid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I said, listen, I'm proud of you no matter what. Right. You know, you just remember this kid's been playing for three years. You just started playing. You're going to get there. Just be yeah. patient. This That's is part right. of the learning process, whatever. But I just felt bad for the kid, you know. <laughs> well. I have a similar story about me, like last week, crying at league. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, but I told you, you you'd get over that. Uh, you just, no, just got to put it out, out of your mem mind there. Put it out of your memory. The, the good news about blowing a shot today is that you get to forget about that shot you blew yesterday. That's right. You, know? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got to look at the positives. Yeah. got to be the yeah. positives. Yeah. yeah, you're right. Donnie Mills set to break. It's 8-8. Eight to eight. This is game number 17. Let's see if he makes one of those uh, second balls uh, in the side pocket. He's yeah. been pretty good about doing that this tournament. Uh, see, look at that ball right there. Right 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 eight ball right. Dead hard. Dead hard. And now he's figured it out. You know, he, he, he cranked it up a couple times and didn't make a ball in the break. And he slowed <laughs> it down. And now he's got the ball going into the side pocket. And you can see the one here, too, to cut it in the corner and come up. Tough first shot. He's a little bit tree topped here. This is yeah, definitely, a little, definitely yeah. a lot different than the Corey Dual break that we saw oh, in the match yeah. before, wasn't yes. it? Was, was, what, what, what was he doing? I'm still, blown, was, I'm still blown away. He was by soft that. breaking. Soft, soft breaking. Oh, I mean, super soft break. Like 10 miles an hour. Against oh, Shane? Against yeah. Shane. Yes. And uh, three balls would be left in the uh, in the rack. Yeah. Bar barely, barely four barely balls moved. would yeah. touch the rail. I wow. kid you not, it was so yeah. soft. <laughs> there was there was one rack where Shane actually got balling in because yep. three balls didn't get a rail. And yep. Shane, you know, wanted to make sure, hey, 
threw balls at a rail, and he ended up getting ball and end out of it. <laughs> wow. Yes. Did he run it out? Shane did run it out with it, ball and He end, finally yeah. started figuring it out, but it was like every time that, 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 that Corey would break, Shane was playing straight pool. Yeah, yeah. It, it yeah. being a strategic yeah. out. Yeah. Yeah. I call it a straight pool 10 ball. Yep. Straight, yeah. straight pool 9 ball. Yeah. Straight, yeah. <laughs> straight 10 ball. I tell you, it looks like looks like Donnie has a road map here. Well, yeah, this, this looks to be the key shot here because yep. the four ball is that the four ball in the bottom right? Uh, the right. Yep. Side yeah. It looks, side. yeah. It looks like he's putting the nine ball in play. I think that's a seven ball. I think he has that's to come right. down, right? Okay. Must, oh, it yeah. must be the seven, seven ball. It is yeah. a seven yeah. ball. Yep. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. You hit right. that great. That's why you hit it like that. Yeah, that's a good shot. He might have hit it too good there. I think it's too straight. Too straight. He's not shaking his head, so he must have gotten all right. That's what amazes us. Always amazed me about the game. You, you try to actually land straight and you can't. Absolutely. Right. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. I hit a ball too good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is he he's hitting them good, Donnie, this tournament? Yeah, yeah he, is. he is. You know, one year he finished, I think, what was it, third, fourth? Third in the yeah, U.S. That's Open. Right. In the U.S. Third Open. That's US pretty Open. strong. Yeah. He's a great player, there's no doubt. Yeah. yeah. And a lot of people out there uh, have not seen much of him. So he, he stays pretty much in Florida. Doesn't travel much. At least he didn't travel much. He certainly isn't going to be going to the West Coast anytime soon. Yeah. He doesn't make it to the Derby City Classic much. I'm not sure if he made it this year. He's been to Turning Stone, U.S. Mm -hmm. Open. A little pinch shot there. Yeah, that's a nice shot. shot. He's going to get on the hill. Hit this with a little pace, bounce off. This yep. is this is a, this is just elementary here. Exactly. Oh. Yep. Just roll it. Just you don't just have to get off the rail. Oh. Yep. He's straight enough to where he's he's got to hit it with a little pace, but right. You know. There you yep. go. Just like Perfect. that. Perfect. Yep. Yep. Nicely done. Looks like Donnie Mills is going to reach the hill first. Yep. With Forston breaking next. Yep. yep. Nice. Nicely yeah. done. Very nice. Look at that. We get a guest uh, technician over here. <laughs> oh, listen, Tony does it Tony all. Robles. Tony does yeah, it all. He does. Phenomenal player. Great, <laughs> uh, you know, tournament director. I just learned runs this the great at leagues. <laughs> <laughs> this is a this is a hanger. I I learned this from uh, Upstate Al. You know, during the yeah, tour the right tournament. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Yep. It gives you a little crap. That's probably the only thing I know how to do this and turn on the mic. <laughs> turn it off. That's it. Yeah, he gives you a little crash course. <laughs> Torsten's actually been, he's been breaking okay, but the cue ball has not really been his friend uh, on the break. Yeah, he's been kind of losing the cue ball a little yeah, bit. Even the couple times that he actually had good control and then he got kicked out of the way. Doesn't have that uh, big pop and stop. Mm -hmm. That's what separates Shane from everyone. Uh, it That's it exactly really right. Is. And really some of the other guys also, uh, Jeff Ignacio, uh, Copigny, they have that kind of break also. Oh yeah. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's a cue. Oh, you didn't make anything. But did he come up dry? Yep. 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 There is Donnie. Push out coming. Tony, if he pushes, what do you like? Man, <laughs> I, I would push by the 10. Yeah. I would try to make it as difficult as possible. Long. Yeah. Yep. I don't like pushing it anywhere near the right side unless he has intentions of jumping over the 8 to get right. the 1, you know? Right. Yeah. taking some time on this. It's interesting to push out because I mean obviously you want to leave it somewhere where, you know yep. he's gonna put the top ball. Go. I mean but see now Torsen might take this and then just play the lock up safe. I mean he well, can sure. play him behind the yeah. two or yeah. Yeah. well that's the thing that you don't have much of a choice here. Right. That's right. just it, yeah. you know, but what I like about what Donnie did there is that and a lot of people don't pay attention to the small little details like that. He took the 10 ball off the cushion just a little bit right. for two reasons. Number one, to slow down the cue ball. Right. Slow down the cue ball. Sure. Right. Leave it closer to the rail. Number two, just in case a combination shot shows up, it's, it's easier when the ball's on the rail. On the rail. You can hit yeah. the rail or the ball first oh. and make it over That's here. exactly right. Yep. 
Yeah, from a statistical point of view, you always you're not going to get any better than a 50-50 proposition yeah. Yeah. after you push because if it was better than 50-50, sure. you you're not going to get it and if it's worse than 50-50, you are. That's right. <laughs> He's spinning around here. Not yet. <laughs> One, two, and oh, and he did ooh. catch that. Yeah, that he didn't want to catch that too. He definitely didn't want to touch no. that two ball. But look, where th but look where the two ended up too. So the two passes the ninth in the corner pocket. Yeah. So yeah, I don't think it passes a side pocket. No, 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 no. no. <coughs> so it looks like, you know, this ends up being a blood tester for, for Donnie Mills. But if he can make the one ball, the two ball is available. And if he doesn't like it, he can always lock him up behind the nine. Yep. Mm -hmm. yeah. it, it, this is the beauty about this game. You can say that Donnie pushed perfectly. Torson really had to sort of shoot a safety there. He, he probably got a little bit too aggressive. And now Donnie Mills got it back for a re rewarded, I suppose you could say, mm -hmm. for a great push. But is this the shot you want? I guess you want to be shooting rather than watching this right. one, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you had the choice. Certainly no sellout. That was a nice shot. Beautiful he shot. Makes it. Yeah. Caught up in the cushion. That, and he actually might be able to make this ball on the side. Two, they two on the side. From our angle, he couldn't. But now that the cue ball's there, he can. Yeah. Isn't that funny? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's <laughs> unbelievable. It's like, there's no way it went until the cue ball got there. Yeah. Maybe, yeah, might be playing safe. I can, you really can't tell. No. Yeah. 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 Yep. Yeah. There it is, oh, right behind the nine. safe, yep. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Rearrange some furniture mm -hmm. in the process. It's always yeah. Would you so kick it as hard or soft? Uh, whatever Efren would do. <laughs> <laughs> I think Efren would try to make, make it. Make the so two. And if he overcuts it, if he overcuts it, the cue ball goal will hopefully go mm -hmm. between the three. And I'll tell you one thing. He six. better. He better. If he does it too rarely, he better hope not that he doesn't catch the, uh, the top behind. side of that too. Because yeah. if he does, oh, yeah. he could go right in the drink. Oh, yeah, I think, sure. I think he huge. wants to hit it dead on. Yeah. He'll try to cut it. Yep. Yep. If you hit the, the second rail, there's a very good chance he's going to scratch. Right. That's what he's looking at now. <laughs> Two rails long to, to back cut. <laughs> yeah, he's taking a lot of time to make sure he wants to get it right. I mean, the way he's lining it up, it looks like he is going two rails, trying to hit you know, the ball thin. Yep. Oh, oh and he missed. Oh. Oh. Yeah. That's it. It went a little long on it. Yeah. It went a little long yep. on it. It's, 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 you know, it's new cloth, so. Yep. Ball in hand for Donnie, and. Another interesting uh, it's pathway here. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of, it's like, kind of what we play the 10 ball right now for the match. I mean. I don't know how anybody else feels about this, but I'm uh, I'm, I'm definitely not yeah. the favored to make it like this. Yeah. No, you know, the ten balls. But you see what I like mentioned said, earlier? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, what he you has said. to hit it better. Oh, yeah. you know, another thing right. too. Not let it soft the cushion a bit. Another thing too. He but didn't you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. If it weren't yeah. the cushion, it would have been easier. It would have been easier to make it. Yeah, that's right. It's more room for error when it's closer to the. So that's what I'm saying when he. But he was the one who moved it there. I know he was the one that moved it there. That's right. It, were, it, it came he back to haunt him. It came back to haunt him. He hit that seat. But he, just, he probably just figures, out. listen, what if it, I'm not the one shooting? What if it ends up being right. here? You know? Well, he also didn't want to deal with that three ball either. Yeah. You know? Right, yeah, that's, yeah, three ball. Getting, getting shape on that three ball, you know, it's a it's like small window. But he didn't put too much time into looking for the two to the three. Yeah, I agree. Um, yeah. I think he, he's actually surprised he missed it. I yeah. don't think he was expecting he was, to miss yeah. that. Right. Yeah. yeah. Cause it's like Fred said, if you're going to shoot the winning shot with the, for the match, you, you got to take a little take more, more time. time. That's true. Yeah, yeah, he did shoot that up. What a beautiful that shot was that was. He's on top of the four, though. Oh, man. Yeah. Trust me, he doesn't That's do that too often. Role. He's such a great player and a great right. straight pool player. Yeah. So he usually has yeah. pretty good control of that shot. Yeah, that's, that's, that's quite unfortunate. Stretched out. Look at this. I'd get a, I'd get a side stitch already doing this. 
Thanks. What a beautiful shot. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, Absolutely nice beautiful. Well, for his next trick, he's cutting <laughs> to, the, to the outside here. <laughs> he's got to cut to the outside. He's got to clear the eight, nine, mm -hmm. six. He's going to hit it with power draw, run into the eight, hit the bottom cushion, and come back up. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Nothing, but <laughs> Nothing but net. Nothing but net. I kind of like jumping the cue ball yep. to the side going over the nine ball mm -hmm. two rails around and hitting on top of the five just enough so the five bounce off the cushion straight into the corner pocket so you're saying elevate the cue yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a little dangerous when you're that far away from the ball it's easier when you're about a foot right. or more foot mm -hmm. or less away you know yeah. but yeah that, 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 that is a possibility you think he's going to follow down and just come two rails back up for the five in the same pocket if he can maneuver around that that uh, I don't that know if eight he can and the get six. around that ball, I think he's going to draw drawn. off yeah. the he's eight. Drawn, yeah. yep. Here's the power draw. Here it comes. If he jumps over that nine, come on. Eight. Off the he's nine, that's yeah. six. That six oh. He's, he's, he's got a shot. Did he yeah. tickle that? Did he got the left tickle. Yeah. 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 I think he's good enough to actually cut this down the rail. And once again, he's got to fade some balls that are tapping yeah, sitting in right <laughs> in the center. You know, I, I talk about this a lot uh, on these commentaries on 10 ball. The reason why 10 ball is so so much different than 9 ball, forget about calling shots and all that, because in this case, there's no call shot. It's the balls that end up in the center of the table that take away that those bread and butter pathways that go yep. you to and through the center of the table. And this is a perfect example. Yeah. Yeah. They try to cut this in the come above that side pocket, I would assume. Mm -hmm. Or between the eight and the nine. Yeah, track oh above the side pocket. Yeah, he made there it. you go. Nice shot. <coughs> he still has work. Yeah. A lot of work. Yeah, yeah. but that was one hell of a shot. That was a great shot. That was a great shot. Right, yeah, really and you can't freely just whack this ball and go. So to what do the you middle. do? You you play safe now. Six up table. Cue ball oh, back yeah. down table. No, he he's has he has enough room to go between the eight and the in the side pocket. I think he's going to hit two rails here. Okay. And once he gets that, that solves this this rack. Not to say he's going to get out, but he would solve yeah, the rack getting right. to the six and the seven right now. This will hit the first diamond above the side pocket. Oh, that's oh he ran into the See, there's, there's, the ten, yeah. there's the ten ball wow. pathway yeah. issue, I don't right? Think, no, I don't think he meant to hit the eight. No, no, no. Yeah. I don't think he meant to hit Absolutely the eight. Not. I think that's why correct. I was kind of surprised he did that because I thought, you know, with him cutting it up in the corner that the, he could the eight and nine were in play. They were coming right into play yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I, I don't think he put enough insights into in no, the past. No, he didn't. Maybe he thought that would, the, with the amount he used, was it was enough. Mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, because yeah, he still had to pocket it. So Back and forth. Nice shot. Yeah. Doink. Yep. There it is. Nice. He hit that great. Yep. He certainly yeah, did. Like a, definitely a, a There's a reason why the man is a multi-world champion. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. That was definitely a professional world championship mm -hmm. type of shot. World caliber. And then to have your back up against the wall, too, when you know that right. your opponent's on yep. the hill, and then you're making these gritty shots like he oh is. Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. that's, that's definitely a sign of a champion, without a doubt. Beautiful. Inside spinneroni. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Nine the side. Roll down for the ton. Inside spinneroni. Inside like spinneroni. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I love it. This is a, another classic what a, what case. A, what, a what, a great, what a great, what a great run. Great out. That, that yeah. was a hell of a run out. That was, right one that was a run great out. run out. Toasty, that was wonderful. And, and we've got we a Hilla, 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 Hilla. Hilla. Oh, look at this. Now the world is ending. Because <laughs> <You know. laughs> now you have to stop your flow to find, you know, think about, oh, I just dropped my name down there. I'm going to step on it. Are they going to use that same one for the next round, you know? Did I put a chalk mark on there? You know, it, these these things bother you. Yeah. When I say oh, yeah. bother people, hey, they listen, bother I'm, me. I'm, I'm OCD, too. You know, you know that. Yeah, yeah. I'm OCD, too. That would it's bother me big time. It's hey, guys, what do you OCD. think about that uh, challenge match between Darren Appleton and Earl <laughs> and that four-pocket table? I've been waiting yeah. for this. I'm looking forward to that. I'm, I really am. I'm so looking am. forward to that. Yeah, it's going to yeah. take the place. Four pocket, uh, uh, fourth pocket, four-pocket match. Yeah. Four-pocket match. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> He's been talking about this for years. You know, about the eliminating the side, side pockets. pockets. Eliminating yep. the side pockets. Yeah. Uh, you know, the first the first shot that's going to come up, it will be him shooting. Oh, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. <laughs> I mean, I honestly, I have to favor Earl in that match. I really do. You know, he's yeah. uh, he's been practicing nonstop 
uh, eliminating, you know, blocking up the side pockets, eliminating them. Right. And uh, constantly, I mean, just incessantly. So I know he's ready for it. It'd be interesting to ask uh, Daz whether he's been practicing on that. I mean, what do you do to practice that? There's only one table that exists, right? Or did, yeah. did, did, did they make two? No, no, no. That's no, the they, only one. That's the, that's the only one, you know, that Diamond has produced. Sorry. There you go. Oh, okay. yeah, that worked. I was told that the Earl practiced yesterday at the King of Vapors table, mm -hmm. and uh, he s threw 15 balls out and ran them all in the corner pocket without making one single shot inside pocket. He was explaining to everyone, yep. you know, why he's shooting it the way he's shooting it and, and the options that you have. Everyone said that the way he explained it makes so much sense. But right. So here we go. It's a 9-9 match. Hill Hill and uh, Donnie Mills to break. He won the lag, so this is where it really... One of those cases where the lag was everything if he break and runs here. Yeah, let's see if that ball goes straight in the side again. He hit a little oh, bit harder than normal. Not. It did so not. He hit that one a little harder than he has been. Once it he goes harder, not. it goes, uh, mm -hmm. goes long. Well, I mean. A little amped up. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think Thorsten can shoot this in the side. I think he has to shoot it in the corner. Corner pocket. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, he has a, a way of leaving the queue. He has a, the potential blockers for eight if he misses. Mm -hmm. But uh, I don't think he can avoid that traffic. Yep. So it looks like the uh, Jennifer Beretta and Vivian Villarreal, their match is completed. I didn't see who won, though. <laughs> I didn't see, see who won either. <laughs> I believe the Mike DeShane match is also completed. I don't know who won that one either. We are so good. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody played and somebody won. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Great shot, right? Beautiful down the shot. That's a great shot. Did a great. And shaping the side. Yep. Shaping the side. Oh, oh no! Let's see if it goes down past the. Looks like the corner pocket hat. <laughs> well, it goes play. with speed for sure. Yeah, if it right. doesn't go clean, it goes for speed. With, with speed for sure. He may have the half pocket here. If that half half pocket by that seven ball. Mm -hmm. oh, he's got more than half a pocket. Yeah, he's got. Yeah, Is he he a full pocket there? He's, no, he's got seven eighths. Yeah. <laughs> 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 a mathematician in here. Here you go. F Fifteen sixteenths. Oh, Boom. Okay. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer Barreto, uh won that match ten oh, she to seven did. over Vivi. Wow. Yeah. That's what my runner says, but my runner could be dyslexic. <laughs> Is that Karen Cora, the right of Jennifer? Uh, it looks uh, at yes. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yep. Oh yeah, so yeah, setting down. Yeah, that's all right. Allison is on the hill versus uh, Ms. Atwell. And the four ball obviously goes. Yep. Yeah, the only challenge I see here is the six to the seven. Yep. Yeah. What do you do? What do you do with five, Tony? Do you go below the nine or above the nine, or back you and know, forth? You know, I, I kind of like leaving the cue ball more or less where it's at, and then going one, two rails between the nine and the side. Nine, so that way, right. I'm, if I don't get dead straight on the six, I, I can still go off the ball and end up on that side of the table. Yeah. You know, the thing with that though is you have to be careful not to stop the uh, the ten ball in front of the eight ball right. you know, and block the pocket. Mm -hmm. So. Well, I mean, this one has a lot more subtleties to it to yeah. because the six ball to the seven ball, as you're talking about, is is crucial to get the cue ball between mm -hmm. wherever he's got to go here. High, low, left. Looks like he's going three rails around. One, two. And he's on the nine. Yeah, yeah he had a straighter yeah. angle. He had Perfect. a straighter yeah. angle. Yeah. That's a good shot. And the ten is still in play here. Yep. Yeah, he can draw into that ten to hold it. To hold it for what? Seven in the side. Does it go in the side? Yeah, it goes inside. Yeah. As good as he shoots, as straight as he shoots. Well, you know, we have to <laughs> pretend that it's, it's, you know, we have to pretend that these guys aren't miracle workers. Yeah, it's difficult. I don't know. From that last that last frame that, that he last, took, that was yeah. amazing. Yeah, really nice yeah. out. Yeah. Let's see what he does here. It looks like he's queuing low. It looks like he's. he's okay. If I was a betting man, I would say that he wouldn't get out here. Yep. Oh, I guess it goes in the side. Yep. There it is. <laughs> Let's look at his face. He's, he doesn't yeah. even care one way. He's like, I'm just going to do this. <laughs> He's definitely looking at the side. Playing the side and just top one rail. Yep. Out Counts middle, out for the, middle of the table for the eight ball. There it is. Yep. Oh, that is easy in the side. Sure. I think uh, yeah. I'm, I'm beginning to hear the fat lady. Yeah. 
Well, you know, this is pool. This is this is not a game of uh, inches. It's a game of, of hairs. Yes. Hairs yeah. on hairs. Absolutely, so yeah. anything can happen here. Yeah. Like uh, like the cue ball coming at the nine ball, the same type of angle. Yep. Nice. Hold He's got it. angle. And here we go. This is yes. the one of the, again, yep. the, the bread and butter. This is the bread and butter rotation shot. Absolutely. It's yeah. actually a very similar that shot. Low, low right. Low yep. right to yep. it through the right center the of the, the table. Yep. And the die on the end rail. Yep. You do not there shoot this with, any, a great you know, comeback. with anything other than with the edge. What a great comeback. Yeah, that was. Is right. Thorsten Homan. Played perfectly yep. for the rest of the match. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, As a match, Richard and Carson Holman yeah. beats Donnie Mills 10 to 9, and he moves on. Wow, listen to the applause out there by the audience. I'll tell you what, I yeah. got to give it up for yeah. these guys right yeah. here Mr. Fantastic. Tony Robles, yeah. Freddie Agnia. No, oh, thank you. Thank Jared you. Aris Amina, the jazz man, Steve Sutton, sudden death. You know, without you guys, we couldn't do it. We got to end okay. this recording. Thank you, fellas. No, thank Thanks, you. Everybody. Thank you. I'm actually Thanks, heading Al. back to New York, so thank you for everything, guys. I'll well, have a safe soon. trip, Tony. Safe right, trip, Tony. Tony. Thank you. Best to you, my friend. Thank you. Thank you. Steve, I'll see you soon.